I will not get in VC. You can't make me. Here we go. No. Here we go. Gwe Dwarf. There we go. Gwe Dwarf. It's Dwarf. Negative two minutes to spare. I started my stream at nine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I no. refuse. Okay. I fuse. I fuse. I, I fuse. Uh, okay, I'm going to quickly do and sound check. No, you ain't. Uh, You're not going to do a sound check. You ain't going to do a sound check. Not going to do it. Yek is no. sound is mostly good. Just going to turn down a shit. There we go. Okay, uh, meatball, speak. I'm speak. yelling at you. Yek, speak again. Yelling! Yelling! I'm yelling at you! Yes, I know you are. Okay, now to jump into Hoy and just double check the sound there. I'm gonna Hoy in your pants. Now, <laughs> welcome to Woman Repellent, the game. It's yeah. Woo! I mean, uh, I'll probably. Uh, yeah, I'll probably go for trans women. Why not? Maybe even trans woman fascist. Or a tanky. Probably gonna get a tanky if this shit keeps up. Okay. But come on, let's be real. Come on. No. I I have no I have no commentary. Uh, my main commentary is. Hello, everyone who's watching. Goal. Are all three of us live right now? Yes. Okay. In which case, allow me briefly to welcome everyone, whether you are on Meatball's channel, or mm -hmm. watching on Yek's channel, or watching on my channel. Uh, welcome Most to... Most people are watching on, meat, uh, or on uh, Meatball's channel, let's be real. They, they, they should be. This is, this they is should be. This is you Meatball's idea. Be. This is all Meatball's idea. Welcome to episode two of the Soviet yes. Stream Special. This... This is a stream special proposed by Meatball in which we play through a number of games detailing the history of the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics. With so, some slight variation. Slight variation here and there. Um, last episode, episode one, we did some pre-Soviet stuff, you know, build up to the Russian Revolution with some World War I games. Now, we are in control, the revolution has happened, the Bolsheviks are in power, Lenin is dead, Stalin's in power, and... Yippee! Yippee! We are... And we get to be his cabinet members. We are, we, no, God help well, us. We are Joseph Stalin's cabinet members trying to manage the Soviet Union through what will become known as the Great Patriotic War. Better known to you guys as uh, World War II. So... With what all... happened in World War II again? Some uh, some uh, some Austrian guy got really angry. I mean, I... I mean, listen. What happened was that the good guys lost. Um, mm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Chat, no. chat, and chat, and chat in every channel. Let's be very clear. I'm very gay, very Jewish, and very left wing. That was a joke. Uh, yes, yes. Except for the part where he thinks Jap Jap like Japan was, you know, justified. Yeah, Japan was. No, really that's. Let's be real. No, that would be. Those are the weebs. Oh yeah, true, true. Ew. I know. Yeah, no, the weebs. Uh, the true weeaboos know that the Empire of Japan did nothing wrong. Mm -hmm. Oh God. Anyway, uh, I'm so happy to have. Don't don't Google everyone anything. here. Uh, all of you should be watching, and if you're not, I'm gonna shit in your ass. Yes. Uh with that, I'm shooting in my ass right now. Uh, uh, my camera is going. Meatball, to... you're offline again. Should I have? Should I have my camera on or off for this stream? You know what? I'm, I'm gonna have it off for the main purpose okay. of this. What do you mean I'm offline again? 
You're offline. I'm, I'm streaming right now. No, I mean on Steam. Steam. I don't fucking worry about that. <sighs> it's gonna crash my game again. I I need you to invite me. Oh my god, we literally went by server ID last time. Not me. Well, you do it by server ID. I was ID. able to join your game. Do it by server right, ID. Fine. If this crashes my game, I'm blaming you. Well, I'm blaming you, have to you set as up well. The server. Okay. I'm, I'm blaming yes. me. The password is going to be the same as last time. Okay. Host yeah, I know the, the server ID. Host Please. the host the server ID. Well, now I can't because it's been banned. Oh Ooh. man! It's real Serbia mentioned. <laughs> mentioned sounds like a Yiddish word. I mean, it's based. It sounds similar to mensch, which is a Yiddish word. Mention sounds like a Serbian word, and therefore we should banish it. Mir menschen euch den benchen. We should poop in Serbia's pants. Yo, right now. Server ID has been posted. Server ID has been posted. So for the purpose of this stream, we Serbian are going to be posted. doing a co-op Soviet Onion game. We will all be managing the Soviet Union together. We'll be playing it together. We have roles... Uh, yeah, here it goes, oh. indeed. What? Hello? Oh, okay, there we go. I'm in. Okay, for those here, uh, oh, uh, f so uh, uh, Fernando the 14th is Meatball Man, Cuphead Erotica Planet is me, <laughs> and Gay Tan is... Yeah, <laughs> gay Tan. Yeah, it's me, I'm Gay Tan. Co-op not allowed? Co-op is never allowed. Allow co-op, you whore. No. I don't want to. So yeah, so we are... The main purpose of this playthrough as well is we will be making some changes, but we're generally sticking to as historic as possible. So we'll be trying to work with the Allies. We will be keeping Stalin in power. We will be going through with the purges. Uh, but... We'll yeah. do it again. We'll, we, we'll, we will do it again. Um, well, actually, no, we're going to do more purges. Listen, 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 yeah. tr true communism would have been achieved if Stalin had just been allowed to kill, like, five more people. We were so close. Not five more people. Like, a good, maybe, uh, million? No, Seriously? no, no, just five more. We were so close. Everyone who died, died for a reason. It's fine. It's like that, you know that meme of, like, two people mining, and one of them is, like, dejected and just walks away while the other one is still mining through? Woo. That, yes. That's, uh, that's us right now. Woo. Anyway, uh, I'm ready when you bozos are. I'm now, not ready. Now remember, when we go in, we, we want to take care of every aspect first. Yep. I'll, I'll start by doing train, uh, railroad boosts. I will be doing logistics. Uh, well, I mean, we're, everyone's yeah. doing everyone's doing a little bit of logistics. Yeah. So my big things are I need to do railroad upgrades. I'll start the construction, yeah. A diplomacy and spies. You need to do infrastructure and uh, um, production lines. Gotcha. Meatball is largely doing military unit respecializations and technology, like, or research. Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, there's everybody... gonna be a lot of overlap here with everything. No, everyone's leaving already, no! Yeah, everybody's watching Meatball. <sighs> Lies. My like one viewer. Yeah. Me. Actually, it says right now you both have two viewers. I have one viewer. <laughs> Oof. I'm. I am that one. Oh, now well, we, we need to. Oh, oh, well, never mind. Like have to now, more viewers. now we have. Now you guys both have one viewer, and I have two viewers. Uh, guys, I think we're literally just sharing a single viewer as well as yeah, all just, of us. <laughs> it's just one person just ping ponging around. Yeah. You know what? To that one person, we love Thank you. you. We do. Okay. Love you. So keep it paused. You serve the Soviet Union. Mm -hmm. Soyuz Naroshimi. You know, I'll have to create a proper Soviet playlist for this. Okay, so I'm starting intelligence agency create. Oh no, I can't. Cre can I create an agency? Yes. Um, we are going to create. Uh, Should we max out Moscow and in infrastructure? That's focus on just the ones that have uh, provide us resources first. Yeah, that's not a bad idea though. It's not a bad idea. I mean, it's not a yeah, it's not a bad. I would yeah, prioritize filling up, fill fill the gaps first is what I would say. Should I should I max it out to five or just okay. one in there? Um, National focus. We can okay. Get that later. We're starting to. We're, I'm going to start by going down the um uh, uh oh right. 
path of Marxist, Marxism, Leninism. We are going to start getting as much political stuff out of the way first. Uh, do do the purges before Hitler gets too uppity. Yep. Uh, open, mustache man. Open country Angry list. We're going to start with Europe and... We're, we, there's some places we're going to start warming up to. Namely, uh, warm up to Spain. Yep. Uh, I, I can't improve... Oh, we're not, we're not going to let Franco... Okay, I can't... Okay, so I can't improve relations yet, so that will wait. Um... Then, uh, construction. So, Yek is adding roads. I am now going to add railways. So, the big thing that I'm going to start with is just upgrading the Trans-Siberian Railway. Roads. Uh, I, I love that orchestra. Shut up. Yeah, I'm going to start with it, and then um, I will later on upgrade more parts of the rail system and we'll add to more. But for right now, I'm just... I'm upgrading everything along the main route. Mm-hmm. I'm giving to, us more yeah. resources. In where? Uh, everywhere. I'm creating more roadways to resources so that we can get more resources. You're good. Oh, not there. There we go. Yep. Um, I'm going to kick some of my railroad stuff up a little bit higher just so we also get some railroads done in the meantime. You know, kind of, like, man, be kind, of, like... kind of like alternating. I mean, we're still going to do mostly roads, but we want to also up, upgrade some of our rail kind of while we can. So I'm going to intersperse Comra some of this. Comrade Meatball, I knew we shouldn't have gave logistics and uh, train uh, train construction to a train fetishist. I'll train fetishize no, you. Fun. Okay. <laughs> Let him fetishize more, actually. Actually, yes. Yeah, probably. Which, who's changing my stuff? Stab. No, I'm also clicking on it. We're, I think we're sharing the same screen. Yes, so. We're sharing the same, sharing the same menu. Yeah, we are sharing. We are actually sharing the same country. So Legitimately. Pretty based, not gonna lie. You're pretty. I, honestly, I like gay. this. Uh, I like this version more than Stellaris's co-op uh, version. I wish they did this more. I wish they didn't do this. This is really annoying. Why is it not? It's not saving my movement of railway priorities. Oh, it's because I'm clicking on it. Okay, you prioritize first, and then I'm okay, going yes. to. Okay. Yes. I'm just. Right. Yeah, I'm just moving the railways. I'm not. I'm still going to prioritize. One more lane, bro. I'm still prioritizing oh, roads overall. Like I'm doing like two roads, okay. and then a railway. Doesn't uh, do that on rubber. Yeah, rubber doesn't get any bonuses with more. You don't get any bonuses. Oh. Uh, okay. Rubber will still be needed, but you know. Yeah, I know, but we're, we wouldn't get any bonuses if I add more infrastructure to that. Well, yeah, not not yet, but it's needed. You, yeah, you will it, it's, still, it's, it's still needed for it. More rubber plus more infrastructure equals better. Yeah. Okay. Ass, uh, ass, 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 titties. Ass. Should we should we prioritize the railroads first or the uh, no, um, I'm, infrastructure first? I, I mean... I'm I'm pro I am prioritizing the infrastructure currently. I I I I'm interspersed. I'm moving some of the railway stuff up a little bit higher. But once I'm done, if you look at it, so don't do it yet because okay. I'm still moving. Once you're done, you'll see what I mean, um, and what mm -hmm. I'm trying to do. I'm still I, I am prioritizing I got... overall infrastructure. Yeah, I got I got most of the stuff. So yes. Uh, yeah. When you get the chance, you'll you'll see what I mean. Just to make sure that we're getting a little bit of it done together, because we want to get as much done as we can. Mm -hmm. Hey. Uh, what percentage of uh, what percentage of roads do we want? What do you mean percentage of roads? <laughs> or percentage of infrastructure? On Just each, make uh... it plus one right now. Okay. Yeah, right. we can we can be more flexible with what we do with our uh, industry yep. later. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, I, each each concentric uh, each one concentric one on top of the next yes um, takes longer yeah. but it doesn't mm -hmm. provide any more bonus gotcha. percentage wise yes. okay so gotcha. I gotcha. static okay so I'm currently clicking away if you look on um so oh. now if now if you go over to construction see what I mean by interspersing the railways a little bit more yeah gotcha. I'm, yeah I'm still prioritizing the roads. 
obviously because well it's not even roads the infrastructure also infrastructure upgrades also improve rail a little bit i think um but upgrading the railway there increases their overall capacity and performance should so. we plan for civilian factories as well so uh in a bit in a bit yeah and when we do that we'll want to do some interspersing there uh mm -hmm. but we're starting with basically our infrastructure needs roads and rail because that will right. allow us to move things and as meatball said last time people will trade with us for our resources especially our oil so we'll get civilian factories that way yeah well, i say what you will at least Stalin got the trains running I'm sorry. uh less so him and more so the people working under him which in this case hey, is that's us. us yay okay i'm gonna start training our uh units right now i was saying do we want meatball to organize them into like, armies whoa. first i was gonna say i already got it yeah let me uh, i'll i'll Take the army. That's fine. Okay. Uh, espionage. So espionage is set. Focus is set. Um, is research. Research is set. That's good Which stuff. Fine. Um, how should I organize uh, the air wing? Should I just create a new theater? Just add them, disperse them throughout the. Uh, uh what is it? Send them to oh, different. Send them, yes. Yeah. Send them to different air bases. Uh, for right now, most of them should be. They are in other air bases. I know, but just make sure you're dispersing them and then group them up accordingly. I usually group them up by by air base, basically. Um, mm -hmm. Make sure we're also going to need some in the far east by Vladivostok, just because Japan will be a pain in our ass eventually. But for right now, most of them should be on the the gotcha. western front. Hey, we granting this strategy. It's Rue! Hey, Rue. Welcome to... Hi, Rue. Welcome to Soviet Union Co-op. We're okay. becoming Soviets. We are. Okay, uh, I've we done most of... I've Soviet. done most of my stuff. For right now. Alright, okay. I got, uh... I got our new air groups. Oh, you, uh, disperse them throughout the, um... Armies? Mean... Oh, right. Uh, give me one moment. Uh... Make sure that you put them on a pilot exercises. Yeah, I already did that. Okay. Cool. Uh, political advisors, I'll talk to you guys about, but I'll take that. Uh, I assume we are largely. Um, Question: Let me see How do so I attach we don't... Uh, air wings to the army? Okay. Go to the air wing. Click a. What did you do? Hey, it's Rue says, yes, I Japan likes to just kind of uh, do that during this time. Go ahead and... It's true. If you look at the box, it's like select uh, a theater. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Several theaters, you don't need several theaters. Um, okay. And just go ahead and look at the bottom mm -hmm. at the different army divisions and just like click the plus button on them. Okay. So like click a specific group. Okay. Okay, I gotta, am... Oh. I'm Turn them off to pilot exercises to do that, then, add, then put them back on. Trotsky, Soviet economist. Let me see here. Um, oh, I'll try to go. mix CAS with, uh, with fighters. Right. Okay, so for right now, when it comes to main advisors, I'm going... So, who put in uh, Genrik Yagoda? He's just there. Oh, he's just there. Okay, so... Oh. I'm going to prioritize um, Captain of Industry uh, Nikolai Vozinetsky and Mikhail Kalinin, because uh, that'll help our stability and our industry, which we need right now. I'd put Khrushchev in, but we don't really need him because our communist support is fine. Uh, okay. Also, don't forget, once we get to 100, uh, we should get work yeah. Yes. Oh no, Meatball became quiet again. Yeah. Tabbing out. Is, I need to find the bar. A little bit. Uh, I'm just going to beef you up just a tad. There we go. That should be an even split. Okay. Cool. Uh, gentlemen, I am ready when you guys are to begin. Also, I just tried to drink my Gatorade with the cap still on. I feel... I feel, yeah. I feel... I feel goofy. Yeah. Okay. If we proceed, I would suggest we proceed at three speed for right now, not four, just because... There's at not least... much going on, right? Yeah, I know, but the thing is, um, 
when stuff crops up for us, since we're all going to have things to be doing, we don't want too much time to pass while we're clicking on things and taking care of stuff. Because we're not going to pause every time someone needs to do something. Okay. So, so I just I, I think three is, three is, you know, it's fast, but it's slow not enough that we can still in... do stuff. I would say four, but sure. What just cropped up? Also, you're gonna you're gonna have to make announcements when we get big things come up. There we go. Emerge the uh, emerge the air wings to the one Soviet theater now. Nice. Uh, is everything in the same theater, or including the including the Far East? Or are you making the Far East into a separate thing? Uh, I can. That might be a good thing to do. Far East into a separate theater, because that's a separate front. Uh, yeah. Airport, yes, this is this stream is not going to pass the Bechdel test. Unless we all become trans very rapidly, which that's what we're trying okay. to do. We're gonna trans it's you. A, we're gonna do it, it. we're gonna trans you. Yep. Okay. We're gonna uh, use our Soviet trans. Look at that. Beam our that we're fuels gonna going up. Cold War. Log oh, our logistics fulfillment, so yeah, the stuff that um uh, um you and I are doing for infrastructure is helping our logistics. Convoys Yippee. are doing okay. Uh, factories is fine. Everything else is fine. Political power is going to take some time to come up, but you know. Yeah. Well, we just did a bloody revolution, so. Well, not just. We're like 20 years after it. That's still relatively. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> relatively oh, yeah, yeah. Also remember, don't. Yeah, okay. Uh, so Meatball is moving the troops along the Trans Siberian Railway. To think, the whole Siberian Railway is trans. Yeah, crazy. That's why it's in Hearts of Iron 4. <laughs> exactly, bro. Oh, guys, look, it's the totally real and independent state of Manchuko. They're real. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 100. Definitely not a definitely not a Japanese puppet. It, it does say that they're a Japanese puppet, though. Shh, 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 shh. They're a Japanese puppet. What's that? Okay. Uh, Meatball is moving the troops to their relative positions. That is good. Uh, should we start developing interwar medium tanks? Um, let me... Uh, we have a lot bigger stuff to deal with right now. Yeah. Okay. That is true. Alright, let's see. Facts. Facts! Oh, yeah. Look at all these handsome... Look at all these handsome guys. <laughs> I'm sure that none of them are about to die in a bloody purge. Oh, the NKVD has been created. Okay, Yippee. let's do that. Up. Oh, okay, so we're gonna start with uh, commando training first, as we discussed. Crypto. Hopefully, we can uh, we can get that bomb that kills people. That'd be nice. Isn't that all bombs? Yeah. Not okay. A there's this, uh, we have there's gonna be this guy Leninism. named. Uh... Jumping into the center, we're going down the Stalin route. Hell yeah. There's gonna be a guy named Oppenheimer, and he makes yeah. a really big bomb that kills people. Like, it's huge. He, like, he, the feels, he feels bad about it, though. But yeah. he also doesn't feel bad about it. Anyway, uh, so yeah, so we're going down the Stalin tree. People are watching. Picture this as we are the Politburo, and we're just sitting there every day frantically trying to make sure that Stalin A doesn't kill us and B doesn't run the country into the ground. Yeah. That, al uh, that alcohol addiction is... Definitely not helping. Well, I mean, everyone in the Soviet Union was addicted to alcohol at the time, especially the government, so that's not a uniquely Stalin us. thing. Yeah. Yes. Speaking of which, I actually have, in real life, a bottle of Russian Standard Vodka for the stream. Yeah. I wasn't, uh, I, do not. I wasn't able to get anything because I was a bit depressed today, but before next week's version of the stream, I will get some stuff. They're a strong and independent nation. You're right, Rue. God, Godspeed to the totally real Republic of Manchuko. Okay, uh, let me see here, that's good. Um, are there any other railroads that I should be upgrading, or is there anywhere you want me to build new railroads? Um, anywhere you see, um, what is that, a port that has not been connected, go ahead and connect it to a railway. Okay, yeah. port, a port, the good news is most of our ports have been, uh... Almost all of them, but there are still probably a few. I'll see. Um, I may also try to double up the Trans-Siberian Railway just to increase our capacity. Yes. That's the big thing. And you thing. might even just want to, like, completely maxing that out till it's up to level 5. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm prioritizing the single line, and then I'll start upgrading the double lines that occur 
around Yekaterinburg. Uh, I'm Can also we... I'm also going to start densifying and improving the lines by the front because that's going to be important. Can we increase the speed slightly? Sure. Oh, no, we no, have no. an a, a, a operative can be recruited. Richard, on the... Richard Sorge, commando training. Let's uh, jump over. We're gonna put sword. Whopper, 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 Sorge whopper, whopper. is going to the Reich, uh, and we are going to now uh, get suicide pills. Sewer slide pills. So, how do you build new rail lines in this game? So you, it has to be coming from an existing rail line. Okay. So. Yeah. Okay. The. Uh, okay. So the. Going down the line, the Stalin Constitution, also the. Rhineland was militarized. Turkey is remilitarized. The Turkish Straits. Oh, perfect. So fucking be it. This 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 is an anti-Turkish podcast. Long live Armenia. Yes. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Hopefully Hassan doesn't hear that. Okay. So I'm. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay. I'm yeah. I'm trying to figure out how this fucking shit works. Yeah, I'm underneath the roads. Uh, once more the roads are done, I'm going to... There, there's a couple new rail lines I'm building just for the sake of connectivity. And I'm going to densify some of the lines near the border, which is copying a strategy the Germans did in World War One and World War II. Which actually worked pretty well for them. Um, Improving worker conditions. Well, we need to modify officer core. Could we do that now or no? Um, actually, for that one... We should wait a bit for that one. Okay. Yeah, I see a lot of... There's a bunch of level 1 lines close to Moscow and heading to the front that need to be upgraded, so I'll do that. Yep. Ooh, Italy is annexing the Sultanate of Assa. Assa these nuts. No, that's not good. Ah, fucking Italians. Spaghetti... Spaghetti people don't deserve rights. Okay, let's start Rude. the cryptology department. Uh... Okay, back to trains. I'm managing the NKVD, NKVD and trains. It's horrifying. Ew. We'll, we'll just send in spies by train. It'll be very covert and not able to be tracked whatsoever. Yeah, no, totally. Okay. I am... Yes, we can't... We don't know where these trains are coming from. If only there was a schedule for when trains arrive and go. Okay. I am working on my sex expansions. That's good. I love sex expansions. Okay. Why would they restrict themselves like this? Why indeed? That's crazy. Damn, too bad we can't care because what the hell is a navy? Yeah, I was saying, yeah. I've, I've never. What is this thing they call a navy? A navy? I don't understand. What How is do you this? pronounce this navy? They. Hey. They, uh, they float in water? Like, uh, or they float in vodka? Yeah? Same. Hey. What is the difference? Hey. You have formed the department. Also, another thing? Yeah, start uh, decrypting Germany. I will yeah. when I get the chance. Give me a second. I'm, I'm, I'm busy building a rail line. I started it. You did it for me, you bastard. I don't have much else to do at the moment. I'll fuck you. I'm, not, I'm probably Please, not going to no. do that. Uh, I will, let's do passive defense. Stalin constitution. Uh, what are we doing next? We are the Zynotev Terrorist Center. Nice. I love terrorism. Uh, we have research slots available. Meatball, you do Got that. It. Uh, let me see here. What other kinds of twains? Okay, so yeah, so I'm, I'm plugging the gaps in some rail lines where better connections are needed, and I'm also going to start ordering upgrades of lines closer to the front. Yes, another we'll... thing, make sure, see if you can connect as many supply hubs as possible. I'm I, I'm working on doing that, yeah. Good, good, good. Yeah, I'm and I'm seeing like a lot of ones in areas where we're going to want more, where we're going to want higher numbers. Um, yeah. All right, I got the civilian train uh, down. Base. Okay. Uh. Here we go yep, one. That'll, that'll be for. Uh, yep. 
I am doing all kinds of little upgrades here, and I'll start interspersing these. We'll just put it on low priority right now. Yep. Um, interspersals. Upgrade this line because... We have a passive. lot of Navy experience for some reason. Well, because prior to us coming in here, the Soviets were investing in upgrading their Navy. Trains need to be motivated to drive faster. Rue, this is very true. We should just, uh, like, whip the train conductor for uh, missing uh, opportunities. Economy, civilian, Izani of Terrorist Center, so I need to wait before going further down that tree. I'm going to do, uh... Should we start uh, putting in naval do uh, we commanders? Do we have... Para are we paranoid? Is Stalin getting paranoid yet? Yes. Okay, so I'll do no, social. Not no, 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 no. He's not. It's not really. Yeah, no. no. Okay, so in which the, case uh, I'm going to jump business. over and do heavy in heavy industry while I'm waiting for how much time it takes for me to uh, deal with We can with modify the government now. What do we want to do? Should we put in military staff? Wait uh, a second. We should go off of civilian economy to partial mobilization. Okay. Okay. You do that. Do you want me to assign? Oh, we don't have enough to assign anyone else yet. That's fine. That's fine. Next up, I uh, would probably want to install either the industry guy or Kalinin. Also, there's a tech slot open. Yeah, I got it. Yeah. Okay, uh, let me see here. Should we do the Stalingrad trailer pack? Oh, wait, no, we didn't. Okay. okay. Stalingrad trailer pack? I'm doing some yes. rail upgrade thingy. Upgrade. Yeah, the, uh, the Sino-Russo War already happened, right? No, the Russo-Japanese War happened in oh, 1906. The, 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 yeah, okay. the first Sino-Japanese War happened in the late 1800s. The second one is going to happen of officially next year, but technically it unofficially started in 1935. Mm, right, right, right. Okay, national focus. The industry is good. Uh, as long as Stalin's not being paranoid, I'm not going to worry about political stuff. I'm going to jump down infrastructure effort. Not enough building slots for... Oh! So, infrastructure effort bypasses not enough building slots for infrastructure, and it gives us some bonus infrastructure. That's good. Gotta run, do some errands. Y'all enjoy, always enjoy ruling the world. Uh, we will. Thank you so much for coming by, Rui. Rui is always appreciated. Rui, you should watch my stream at some time as well. But yeah, but, and also meatballs. But not mostly mine. meatballs, yeah. not mine. Well, mine, because I, like Rue, am a loyal Bren Faniel of Bren Daniel. I watch Bren Daniel sometimes. You've never watched Bren Daniel. You don't even know what a Bren Daniel is. You're right. I don't know what Ann Bren Daniel is. What's Ann Bren Daniel? What's in Dan Brenniel? Yeah. Well, it seems like our men power is strong. And Brunel. Man. Yes. Oh, the Olympic Games happened. Uh, Jesse. For my next impression. Jesse Owens. For my next impression, Jesse Owens. Okay. Ooh, I can recruit another Agnant. Uh, I'm gonna get. We're getting. I'm getting. Uh. Should I get? Okay. So should I get the seductress Natasha Bondaroya? Yes. Okay, woman. Let's go. Woman? Women. In a boy four game? Impossible, I know. Okay, sending her to southern Germany. Hey, but we don't have to talk to her. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah, that's why we're sending her to the Germans, so the Germans have to talk to her. And then the Germans are like, oh my god, that's woman? Okay, uh, infrastructure not, effort not is this. done. Okay. You should go back to the paranoia bullshit. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Thank you for letting me know. Yes. Uh, no, yeah, paranoia over. Is... Yeah. Stalin's guys. Stalin's becoming paranoid. Quick, uh, socialism in one country. Let's do this. We okay. Gotta save. We got. Jab. Oh God! I just thought of another Blazing Saddles reference. Gentlemen, we got to do something to save our phony baloney jobs. True. Okay. I'm also going to quickly jump into diplomacy and reach out to the countries we need to. Spain. I'm going to start improving relations with. And Romania, I'm going to start improving relations with because Hungary is probably more, most likely to go fascist, although Romania certainly, uh, Romania usually does too, but since it's closer to us, we have a little bit of a better chance of 
staving them off. Also, do you want yes. me to do anything with uh, our um, uh, our fucking uh, what is it? Ah, uh, yes. Our our fucking uh, fucking uh, yes, that thing. Do you want us? Do you want me to do anything with our uh, with Mongolia and Tanatuva? Uh, also, you should increase relations with. Actually, with who? Sinkyang. Okay. S we don't even need to do that. We can just honestly. Sinkyang. Probably just get away with. Socialism in one country has been achieved. Congratulations. Uh, should should I guarantee the independence of Sinkyang or no? I'll I'll do that. You got secure the administration. All right. I don't want to. Done. Too bad. Okay, administration's being secured. I think he clicked off of it. Uh, someone fucking... Yeah, because I'm doing it and you clicked on it. Alright, fine. Well, I, you're busy, so I... I wasn't... Do... This is... Let me... Let me do my things. I'm not interrupting with okay, your things. Okay, fine. Moshe talking really to women, it's more thing. likely than you think. True. Only because he's obligated at work. Yeah. No, women are fine. No, they're not. This has been a paid advertisement. <laughs> By big woman. Ethiopia has capitulated. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, Spain. We have market access, and uh, we are improving relations. Same with Ru same with Romania. That's good. Uh, I'm full on fuel. Nice. Let me go back to upgrading trains real quick. That's one of the other reasons why we should have. Uh, why it's good that we uh, increase the infrastructure there, because the more oil we get, the more fuel we'll have. The more fuel, the more we'll fuel have. we have, the more, the more women we can fuck. Why would we do that? Mm, yeah, fair enough. Why would Why you fuck women when the men are right there? They're all gonna die in the purge. Uh, right. should we put, uh, should we put anti-air in the queue as well? What? Modify officer core. The toad anti-air. No. Put it on the production queue? Oh. We're not gonna have put it in a template. Alright. Uh... Oh, I don't give a full fuck about that. Do that, I'm... I'm infrastructuring a well. Soviet onion. The radio has been invented. Congratulations, gentlemen. Yay! Mechanical computing has been invented as well. Yes, all of these kicked off at the same time, which is actually not terrible. I don't think it's good. Yeah. Okay. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Bitch. Bitch. Welcome to the stream where Moshe clicks the railway button endlessly. That's my job. I serve the Soviet Union by clicking the railway button. True. I am proud to do this. Part of the Soviet Onion, it is my duty to click on the railway button over and over again. He's proud to be in a Moshekin. Yes. I'm proud to be in a Moshekin where at least I know how to pee. Good to know. All right, new focus. Working on it. No stalling. Casual anyway. focus. Okay, can yep, I? Oh, paranoia. can I go after? I can go. Okay, I can go after Trotsky. There we go. That going after Trotsky should help the paranoia if if it's historically accurate. Yep. Man, look at. Uh, oh wait, no. Political paranoia increases by thirty percent. F. Well, we still need to do it in order to later get it lower. Yeah. Trotsky looks very, very disappointed. I mean, yeah, because because Stalin fucked up his plans. Fucked up half Stalin. of them, stole the other half. Stalin, yeah, why are you um, so mean? Also because uh, Lenin specifically wanted Trotsky to take over. Yeah. Or at least was more favorable to Trotsky. Uh, I'm probably going to add Well, he a... did specifically say, 
whatever you do, don't let Stalin take power. Yeah. No yeah. matter what. Unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, he said that when it was way too late. Like, by, like he said that on his deathbed in a letter that since Stalin was able to s suppress. Sh guys, should we add in some uh, officer corps? Uh, For what the navy? No, we no, just want to get doctrines. Oh, okay. We're we're good right now. All right. So there were. We don't need these other ones right now. We're it's just it's, it's to get it our said that there were officer corps point upgrades. Okay, yes, we, we just wait till we get to 100 and we can get. Uh, yes, anti Trotskyist center has been completed. Uh, uh, the wait. workers' dictatorship. Er, yeah, I'll do the work. Yeah, I'm just trying to speed run to cult of personality. It's more. I'm actually going. Oh yes, to... okay. This will de. Okay, yeah. So doing the Trotsky thing leads you to options that decreases paranoia. We're doing this very quickly. Okay. Oh we're, yeah. How do we're uh, keeping Stalin do at bay? Leader... How do leader traits work? Meatball. So, actually, one second. Um, do you want to get uh, Kalinin? Uh, Kalinin, or do we want to get the industry guy? Get, get Kalinin. Okay, need uh, this right now. I'll do that. Kalinin, Mikhail Kalinin. There we go. He's what was in. that? Yeah. Uh, leader traits. Which, for like, which leader? Uh, for our generals right now. Uh... So we uh should we just put in leader traits or no? Um, let me let me get those. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see, next one. Should we just add Trotsky? That would be pretty funny. What, as a leader? Yeah. Yeah, maybe if, yeah, if you want Stalin to kill us, okay. Survivability studies has been concluded. Stability is doing pretty good. Okay, the uh, infrastructure efforts are mostly interspersed. Oh, we're doing good there. There's a lot being built. I like that. Uh, okay, I'm going to take a break from that for now. Go over to the intelligence agency, which I've been neglecting, unfortunately. Uh, let's work on interrogation techniques. Uh, Probably... Uh Operations. Give you a do, do you here. want do you want me to infiltrate civilian administration yet or should I wait a little bit? You can do that a while. I mean in, in a while or do it now? Do it now. Okay, you said in you said a while. You can do it a Day. while. So I don't know. A what that while, means. not in a while. But you yeah, said once you can do it a while and I don't know what that means. Whatever, I'm doing it now. Here we go. Commence when ready, prepare. Go. Okay. Finally starting to actually catch up on guns. Good. Research. Yeah. Oh, research is finished on a lot of that. Uh, I'll um, probably just start adding naval commanders. Workers' dictatorship. Uh, military conspiracy. Uh, don't meet the requirements yet. Okay, I need to wait like 175 days again, so I'm going to jump back over to industry real quick. Uh, finish the five-year plan. Oh yay, workers dictate. Oh no, I need uh we need more we need okay, so I need more controlled factories than one hundred and we're stuck at eighty five, so we might want to start start you building can do the factories. You, you can do the collectivization process. Yeah, I'll, I, I I will do that. I just wanted to check so, in I just wanted to check or? industry. Civilian. Should I build civilian factories? Yes, okay. civilian factories are always the first priority. Alright, I'll start maxing out the ones that we yeah, already you, so built. So start you also the Don't. spent uh, okay. the, the Spanish towards the center. The Spanish Civil War gotcha. has started. Do we want to send someone there? Uh, the Spanish yeah. Civil War has started. Let's help. Uh, let's help regular Spain. All right. 
Yeah, and once you're done with the civilian factories, I'll do interspersing with them so we're getting them done. But yeah, I need, I need like, 15 more factories before we can finish the five-year plan. You got it. Well, I'm starting to... Yeah, I'm just starting to put them up in the center, so... I know. Uh... Okay. That... Uh, Meatball, should... do you want to get an expeditionary force there? I'm already doing that. Perfect. Once they're there, um... I can help out a little bit with that. Spain will allow a volunteer force. Excellent. Let Is me actually, why not, I'll do that. I don't have much to do right now. Okay. Okay, done. Uh, awesome. Okay. Go, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, I will, so you did that. I'm gonna quickly jump over to construction and do some of the interspersals there. There we go. What's going on in Spain? Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, oh, the Chinese have united. That's oh, good. The Hindenburg oh, the Hindenburg Oh, fuck. The oh, fuck. They got the Hindenburg. Oh, no. game over. Stream yeah. ended. Stream ended. Okay, the... Our divisions have the arrived. I got the Spanish volunteers. I got them. I, I literally said earlier I'd get oh, okay. them. Yeah, he doesn't right, have right, anything right. to do right now. Besides research stuff. Let's see, how's our production doing? I'm, I'm working on uh, the uh, construction lists. Right. Also start uh, working on uh, military, or start planning on military factories as nah, well. No, we don't need that right now. Do, do we, we not? Seriously don't. Yeah, no. Okay. The, 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 we need to really build up everything else before we do yeah, that. Yeah, you do remember all right, all right, who yeah. is the uh, king of the Soviet Union or whatever the fuck words you want to use for it. Right, yeah. right, right, right. Well, well, I mean, also, like, we can't really expand military factories until we fix our situation with infrastructure and civilian factories, because it takes both of those, you know? Right. So, okay. by doing this, we're setting up to go ham on military factories in a couple years. <laughs> and I'm working on kicking up some of our civilian factories up the chain. Not all of them, but doing some interspersals, so... We're kind of getting a little bit of everything done at once. All right. Actually, how many? Uh, how many do you want me to put up there? Collectivization process. Working on that. I'm. Uh, so you put a good amount of civilian factories down. I think that's good for now. Mm. Can't do the. Get the addressing internal affairs. Over there, uh, yeah, good idea. Start, yeah, I should start that stuff. Go down there. Ooh, the Trudoviks are, hmm, but I wonder what happened to them. Mm. Sure would be a shame if, you know, they fucking, uh, got purged. Okay, interwar oh, nice. artillery is done. Very nice. We're positive on all of our trade. Is there a way to change what music we're listening? What music I'm hearing? Yeah, you can actually. I know, there, I know there's a playlist, player. but I'm wondering yeah, where it is. Players. Underneath the the pausing menu. Okay, awesome. I'll go into that when I get the chance. <gasps> no, they got it first. The Hindenburg. Now Amelia Earhart. You know, the, you know the rules, guys. This means no, you no airplanes anymore. I guess we all just have to build more trains. Air Shame. Airplanes have been canceled. Besides, besides, you know, of course, Amelia Earhart was going to be lost. She had to land at an airport, and she, we, we don't know what those are. Doomed from the start, I tell you. Ooh, Japan declared war on China. Yep, the Sino-Japanese oh, war is start. Well, no, it's this is on time. It's starting on time. Okay, the Regional Defense Council of Aragon declared war on Spain. I think they are, the Regional Defense Council is more communist, so the question is, do we want to start supporting them instead? They are technically not aligned. Technically not aligned, but they are, those are the, oh right, no, those are the anarchists. The Soviets don't like the anarchists. Mm -mm. Okay, uh, decisions, De there's decisions uh, to be made. Uh, I'm going to... Uh, oh, yeah, political, political paranoia is at 35%. Oh, I can do the military conspiracy. There we go. We're doing the purge. I did a bit, a bit against it already. Yep, yeah, I'm doing the purge. 
I would no. yeah. I would say right now, if there's anything, um, I think it's a bigger deal right now to attack the Nationalists, because the Nationalists are making more ground. They are making more ground, but if we can go ahead and cut that pocket off, because we're already being encircled. Oh yeah, there's already an encircled, well, I mean, so, well, right now, it looks like our tanks are shooting at, uh, at their, are defending against them doing a full encirclement. Also, if it's at all possible to send more soldiers, I don't know if it is, but... We can't right now. It's fair. Uh, is there anything else that we want to do to help the Spanish out. Um, hmm. We don't really have much to spare at the moment. We're kind of a little screwy at the moment ourselves. Oh no! It says we have we have market access with nationalist Spain. That's not good. <laughs> We're helping. Uh, them. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna send. Can I send an at? Oh, no, I need to improve relations with. You uh, can cancel market access to them. Okay. Yes. Cancel market access to them. I am. We cannot send an attaché yet to regular Spain, but soon. Nationalist Spain likes us. That is bad. Uh, I am going to... Uh... It's it's not the end of the world. Yeah, That's... I know, I know. I just want to make sure we're not... Uh... So what if Nationalist Spain likes us? Yeah, so market access would allow us to buy equipment from each other's market. Is there a way to stop market access or no? I already canceled it. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Good work. Okay, so we're doing what we can there. I'm resuming relations with Republicans. The Spanish Republicans, at least. Oh, Marco Polo Bridge incident! Fuck! There we go! America's neutral for now. Uh, we'll see how they like Pearl Harbor. Anarchist <coughs> uprising and Spanish Civil War. Unsurprising. Are our divisions going against the anarchist pocket right now? Uh, by the way, I'm gonna be... Yeah, to, yeah, just make sure we're defending against the, um, uh... Is the, the nationalists are almost encircling. We're holding pretty well right there. Yeah, on. but they, it's, ve it's very close. It's very close. See, the thing is, we're being attacked from both sides now. And we can okay, upgrading passive defense. Improved machine tools. Oper Honestly, the car operations. Out. I think operations. We are. How how can I tell if an operation is ongoing right now? Um, there is not right now, but it would say like in process or something. Okay, like so 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 I guess infiltrating the civilian government was successful then, because I did that operation. I assume it was successful. They're both still alive. Uh, I'm going to do... Okay, I am going to jump to... Uh... Okay, I'm going to do Block of Rights and Trotskyists and then Behead the Snake because the first one increases paranoia, the second one decreases it, so... No. Oh, no, never mind, I can't start this. I need... Okay, I need to wait 175. Uh, we have Air Force traits. Or we have, we have uh, new traits. Modify no, gov- uh, military doesn't- yeah, there we go. Modify government. Do we want to add an industrial concern or add a theorist? Um, I did war propaganda instead. That will increase our war support. Okay, awesome. Mm. Makes sense? All good. Okay, doctrines available. Trains. Which doctrine? Submarine ops. Submarine ops? Makes sense. Gonna jump now into uh uh right. what are we what, what should I do next uh I will do I'll do diplomatic training next cryptology we are about halfway through decrypting the Germans by the way uh yes. Don't forget to keep building up the... I see you're doing it now, but yeah. Yeah, we're we're building up. Research is ready. Jumping over quickly to construction to continue my... Oh, never mind. Uh, yeah, get the, I can't uh, do the war economy. The war economy. 
get. We okay. We have some civilian. We have a couple more civilian factories available, which is good. But I'm gonna jump into war economy first. That's good. There we go. I'm going to increase. Yeah, I gotta continue adjusting slash moving up uh, our factories. Up the priority list. Oh, making a spearhead there, that's good. Stuff is being done very nicely. There we go. Stuff mm. is. Can stuff we do is... anything about the supplies? Agency, diplomatic training. Oh. Uh, oh, capture cipher. Uh, definitely want to do that. Prepare. Oh, there's some good options here. Okay, going to jump into passive as well. The Yellow River Blown, oh right. Oh no. That's not- oh, that, that that killed millions of people. You that should, crazy. um, do the collaboration government as soon as you get the chance. Uh, where is that? It's under operations. Okay, it's under operations, yes. Well, I- I- it's- yeah, I will as soon as I can, but, uh... You can do it, like, three or four times, and that means that just yes. Germany will capitulate more quickly. Based? Uh, can, 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 can I call the base department? No. No. I wanna. Too bad. Okay. This is good. We're getting... Our production numbers are good. Like, we're, we're able to work on, like, four things at once now, production-wise, which is very good. The Spanish volunteers are holding fast. Very nice. They, they'd better, because here's the thing. Historically, the fascists are more likely to win. It's not impossible historically for the others, for the Republicans to win. It's just not very likely. So anything we can also, do... Also, I, uh, I put our tanks down there. Both to get more experience with them. Yes, very important. And also because what the hell are the nationalists going to use against tanks? Yeah, also, so the, the nationalists did end up getting tanks from the... Uh, from the Germans, German. so it's so with the Republicans did not have great tank forces, so it's also just historically very smart that we're uh, yes. that we're doing that. Bang bang! bang. We're, we're sending in the tanks. We do as the Russians do. Well, Bing Bong, your tanks are wrong. Okay, decisions. You're dealing with decisions there. The war economy is done. Uh, can I? Can't deal with the Trotskyists yet. That's fine. Gonna jump over to addressing internal affairs. Expand the agitprop. There we go. I love expanding the agitprop. Uh, Spanish gold reserves. 11 days left. When do you guys deal with mm -hmm. that? As a meatball's gonna yeah. handle that. Yeah, I, I'm, we're gonna take the Spanish gold. We love the gold standard. Now, that is good because it means that if the fascists there win, we still do the, some damage to them. Construction 2 is finished. Do you want me to move something up there while you're dealing with the Spanish, or do you got it? Uh, but with the Spanish stuff, I'm decent right now. Okay, did you... Okay, you got the research going good. Oh, you're, oh, you're putting in... Oh, you're making armored trains. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Oh, we're making armored trains? I mean, as 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 we discussed last night, the Soviets were one of the only people to extensively use armored trains as they were intended, especially during World War II. And it made sense because they relied on their rail lines and with all that distance to cover, it's uh, good. Usually armored trains are almost universally a terrible idea, but in World War II for the, the Eastern Front, they had lose... some use. Yes, if we lose trains... That means there's been deaths. And that means mm -hmm. that um, we will lose war support. Yeah, we yeah, it, yeah d defending our rail line is a cent more even more so than any other country because of how vast Russia is and how harsh a lot of the environment is. The rail is absolutely fucking essential. Uh so should I go down So okay, there's a split decision here. I can go down collectivist propaganda, which increases non-core manpower, 
and division recovery rates, and then go down Soviet emulation, which increases Ooh. our economy stats. And just also... And then like leads this. to socialist realism, which is just ideological stuff. Going down the other way, positive heroism is uh, increases our military stats, and we can pull on Zukov as a theorist, and he's great. I, can, yeah, I, I like Zukov. I can revive the Stanikovite movement after that, which is increases factory and dockyard output, and then War Heroes, which boosts our military. So, if I go down the collectivist propaganda route, it's mostly a, uh, economic bonuses. Positive heroism is mostly military bonuses. I cannot do... Yeah, yeah. those are mutually exclusive. Yeah, I cannot do uh, both, so which one should I do? Economic or military? I think we should focus on economic, yeah? Yeah. Okay. We'll still have Zhukov, he just can't be a theorist. Honestly, mm. it doesn't, it's not really even super yeah. important, that? Okay, going down collectivist fruit there. Alright. And... Uh, Your cipher has been captured. Oh no. Our cipher? Or their cipher? Their. Good. Their oh, cipher. Boy. Completed. Finished. Outlook risky. We captured their cipher. Beautiful. That is oh. exceptional. Oh, right. oh, oh! That basically means that we now only have like 40 days before we will totally decrypt the Enigma. Fuck yeah. Okay, I'm going I put, to... I put it in the queue. What'd you put in the queue? Oh. The, uh, the armored train. I put it at low priority, though. So, it's all good. It's fine. You still have the civilian train. You want to get rid of that, then. Oh, okay. I got it. We have a lot of civilian trains now, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Yosh! I'm going to do a uh, radi... Uh, so now that we've decrypted, I'm going to do machine-assisted decrypt... No, I can't do that yet. Uh, I will do... Uh, hmm. Gov... Nope. Yep. There goes Austria. Okay, uh, so... The Anschluss happened? Fuck. Spain yep. was annexed. Uh our guys are being sent back. We're, we should be fine, but we got a bunch of experience out of that. Which is good, yeah. Right. We, we, we lost this. That was historically accurate, at least, unfortunately. Uh, oh, I'll wait, do... Uh, I'm gonna do... Uh, I'll upgrade passive defense one more time. <sighs> do Very not based. do anything. Do not do anything that costs political power. Okay. We need to lower Stalin's uh, paranoia. Okay. I am moving my people back. Oh in, yeah! Oh jeez! Yeah, I'm moving my people back into the Reich to establish their networks. Okay, good. And nationalist Spain. F. Yeah. We sh we should have seen uh, we should we should expect. I mean this. I mean again doing a historical run that's likely what's going to happen but it's not exclusively that. Yeah, Stalin paranoia is going up. When when that goes full, it's uh oh time. That means we we're, we're getting purged. Yeah, again the paranoia is partially going because of options that I've been having to do. Uh, I will. Damn it, Moshe! Okay, you so and your once this options. is done. I will behead the snake, which will decrease his paranoia by 30. Yep, and we get to kill That's Trotsky. And then, but then I'm going to have to go for the block of rights and Trotskyites, which will, at least for a time, uh, increase uh, his paranoia by two every week. And then, but then when we jump down to um, uh, the Cult of Personality, that uh, should help. And it increases our political power. And then there will be big decisions on whether we consider ourselves the servant of Lenin, or if we go down, we are overtaking Lenin. Forces have returned home from Spain. I've reduced the uh, put bleh, paranoia a bit. Welcome back, boys. Oh god, yeah, our our construction capacity is going quite well right now. Alright, look at um look at Zukov's army real quick. You can see the ones that were in the were fighting in Spain, the ones that were. Yeah. Let's see. 
they're doing well. Let them tear each other apart in their victory. Passive Very defense. Nice. Fuck you, Spain. Treaty of Barcelona. No, not. Uh, sucks that the fascists won, but we'll get our revenge on them. Collectivist propaganda. Okay, I am going to jump over and behead the snake. Good idea. I'm mean, actually. We're killing Trotsky two years early now. We're so efficient at this. Very efficient at killing Trotsky. Based. Based. Dude, I I just want a 360 no scope Trotsky. In the face. Based. In the face. With, with, with a pickaxe. Oh. Ice pick. Sorry. Good choice. That's another history joke. You're you really I couldn't tell. Explain it to me in excruciating detail. Well, you see, what happened with when Trotsky was assassinated. What what ha happened was what happened? he had an ice pick shoved through his temple. Ooh. The whole thing. He also I didn't he also didn't die immediately. He fucking fought the guy off. No. He, uh, we described the cipher of the German Reich. Okay, I'm tabbing back over for that. Should we uh this should loyalty in the NKVD is an event. We should deal with that now. Yes. Should we do forge satisfactory pro, uh, production Wait reports? a second. Wait a second. We're not dealing with that. We're dealing with this loyalty in the NKVD. Yes, deal with that okay. first. Uh, okay, so now passive defense is at maximum. I'm going to infiltrate the army department. Good idea. Uh, then cryptology reveal... I can reveal intel which activates decryption bonuses. We will gain the following bonuses for 30 days. The enemy will be aware of our decryption efforts and will reset their cipher afterwards. Do you guys want, so you guys will have to tell me when, so I have at any moment, we can decrypt the Germans for 30 days. And then we have okay. to go through some of the cipher focus again, but we'll be able to crack their cipher easier with the stuff I'm building up. So you guys will have to tell me if you want me to reveal, when you want me to reveal their intel. Alright. Yes. And also I will decrypt the cipher next. Can I decrypt another cipher? Yes. Okay, I will do that for Japan next, I think. Good idea. Go. Um another thing again, um, so when you can under the operations. Yes. Uh, prepare collaboration government. Again, you said that, I will, but I cannot right now. Yes. I need to I need to yeah, I need to re um after that after their two successful operations my people returned to the Soviet Union so they're back upgrading their shit now. That'll be the next thing they do for sure though. Okay, back to construction. There we go. Making sure we're intersperm thing. Intersperm. Head the snake. Trotsky's dead. Okay. Nice. Yippee. Um, so jumping to the block of rights and Trotskyites, uh, this will slowly re-increase his paranoia, but slowly. All the Trotsky fanboys be like. Uh, okay, heavy MG is researched. That's good. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Researching a lot of different plane stuff right now. I'm also trying to oh, balance yeah. our tanks, which are up to date, so we don't need to do much there right now. And also our infantry stuff. Most of which, again, we're pretty up to date. Yeah. Okay. Uh, our, uh, okay, so our, our construction is pretty much well interspersed now with, we'll be doing infrastructure every now and then, and uh, factories and railway stuff for what we have right now. I don't need to re-intersperse it for now. I'll touch on it later. Oh, hello, Miles. Civ 6 and you got Byzantium. Base. Nice. Okay. Uh, I cannot do that yet. So next thing I'm going to do is... Oh, prepare for collaboration government. First, I need to recruit a new person. Who should I do? Kuzma Vashenko looks good because he's slutty and well-groomed. Um, mm -hmm. Kim Philby is okay because he's a uh, he's a good double agent and infiltrator. Hmm. Oh, and then there's a uh, Ramon Mercader is has access to Spain. 
So should I go for Kuzma? Maybe Spain. Should I go uh, Spain yeah. and Mexico. So should yeah. I should I recruit him? Yeah, let's go with Ramon. Uh, um, one sec. Um, I, I either feel like I should do him, or I should do Alexander Rado, or I should do Kuzma Vashenko. Do Vach do Vashenko. Yeah, that that was my first instinct, and send him to Germany as well. So we're just totally. Fucking up their shit, and also, if I remember correctly, Vishenko's actually a real guy. I mean, he didn't look. Most of like these guys are. Uh, Sorge was. Sorge ended up getting captured and killed by the Germans, but he did some pretty excellent stuff. At least I think I could be wrong on that. Also, uh, I can do uh, prepare collaboration government prepare. Yes. All right. Uh, so I'm starting with Sorge and. I will send Natasha. I'm going to leave Kuzma there because he needs to do his shit. It says the duration is 90 days, so should I do it? So you do want me to do it do now? Do it as soon as possible, yeah. Okay. Because the thing Prepare. is, each uh, each uh, one after it, Yes. each one sequentially after it is going to take longer. Well, we're negative in political power. Yes, we are. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah. The thing is, it's either that, or let Stalin go mad yes. and fucking kill also, us. Also, um, because I did that, so True. I so I unlocked agit prop, so agit prop is now an option. And we're forging satisfactory production reports. You're taking care of that, I assume. Um, you're you're yeah. doing decision stuff, right? Just make sure we're following up on Correct. the decisions. Okay, I don't have too much to do now. Which is probably good. Uh, I will now... I'm going to jump into uh, Government Cypher School. Mm -hmm. Because now that we've unlocked one, that's good for the others. So again, you guys just let me know when you want it and I will do the thing. Also, yeah, Japan's invasion of China is happening right now. They're all work... The, the Chinese, at least, allied and are working together with this good. Do we want to offer any... Actually, do we want to offer any diplomatic assistance to them? To who? Uh, we, to, we can. Uh, to China. Diplomatic? We have 16 political power. Okay, so I'll hold... I, again, I'm just asking. Cult of personality. I don't meet the requirement. Okay, I need to wait 175 days for that. I am going to double-check industry. Can I finish the five-year plan yet? Close, but not quite. We need 10 more factories built. We're working on it. I yep. will, um, oh god, send military advisors to Spain. We could have done that a little bit earlier. That probably would have helped, but I didn't. Oops. Yep. That was a mistake. Uh, that's fine. I am going to go down, uh... I will still go down the common turn path, though, just so I can open up inter international options. Yeah, I should have done common turn earlier and assisted Spain with that one option. Alas. Yeah. It's fine. Mistakes were made. Uh, it's, we're still down, going down the historical options, so we're good. We have thoroughly infiltrated Germany spy-wise, though. Uh, this is good. So, uh, Meatball, do you want to describe some of what you've been doing with our armed forces for the lovely viewers? Hello? Not much. Okay. Uh, mostly trying to find out who the hell is going to get purged. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Did, uh, so, did, so, last, when we were testing it, you said that there was some stuff that you had done to alter our divisions, or division types, unit types. Yes. You just Temples. describe those to the lovely viewers. When so, you get the chance. Yes. So basically, actually, which I'm going to do right here, is I change their division template. So, yes. um, saying she capitulated. Fuck. Hmm. Basically. Um. I'm just looking at the division uh, right now so people on my screen can see. Describe yes. away. 
Um, sorry, a bunch of shit just come up. Um, uh, yeah. airport, we are, um, uh, you can call us Politburo, or are you winning Soviets? Right now, overall, we are. There's only one real slight uh, fuck-up that happened, and it was slight. War hasn't happened yet, so. Here's the thing. Um, we're worrying about Germany, which is yes. a far bigger fish to fry. Oh, it, oh, it is for sure. Common turn is good. Okay, so yes, describe the division changes you've made. So basically, I'm going to be adding more artillery. You got your uh, national focus, by the way. I know. I'm just I'm I'm, I'm showing the screen right now for uh, for the lovely yeah, folks at home. Undersea okay. blockade. Um, what? Uh, for our uh, naval doctrine, should we do undersea blockade? Yes. Done. Yeah, I'm okay, gonna go. Um, I'm gonna go down the collectivist secu collective security so I can ally with the allies. So um, basically, I'm adding more artillery to our divisions and infantry. Still have more suppressive um, okay. power and attack. We have an engineer company. Um, I see. Yes, engineer company, and we're eventually actually might as well do it right now. Um. Armored Light Recon. Probably a good idea for the infantry. So this is going to be a very solid, um, solid beginner one. So if you look at this, soft attack is 165.9. That's really... That's not phenomenal, but it's pretty solid. Considering how many soldiers we have, solid is more than enough. Yes, it's okay. really mostly we need to focus on um, industry stuff. Right. Uh, okay, I'm gonna do radio interception group now, so I can do more cryptology stuff. Uh, prepare collaboration government is in process. Cryptology, the Jer uh, Japanese, we have, uh... If, if I get a- if I- if, if I get a fourth agent, I'm sending them to Japan to assist with that. Yeah. Also, a reminder to anyone watching me, um, uh, I am co-streaming with two friends right now. You can go watch them, and I highly recommend following them as well. One of them, Yektan, Y-E-C-K-T-A-N. Look him up there on Twitch to see his perspective. He's mostly dealing with um, uh, um, certain aspects of logistics, and especially the air wing. Uh, also, Meatball Man, whose idea this is, M-E-A-T-B-A-L-L. -L. Double underscore B A L. Oh, sorry, I said that. Ah, M E M E A T B A L L. Double underscore M A N. Meatball double underscore man on Twitch. This was his idea. He's doing the main decisions, overall military adjustments right now. We'll all take, we'll all collectively command the military when it comes time to war, but he's doing like the big logistical and management stuff for the military right now. Go watch him as well. Absolutely, he needs it. He's also new to streaming, so he needs his support more than us. Uh, What's next Hungary, on renounces, Hungary renounces the Treaty of Trianon. Uh, Hungary may soon... Oh, no. So, okay, so Hungary's being an ass. Munich Agreement has happened. So Jesus the Christ. Sudetenland has been claimed by the Germans. Okay, I am moving Sorge back into uh oh no they're on the okay they're on the mission right now okay so he they're away right now uh oh uh are so everyone has good commando traits that they're learning overall in the spy network that's good yes everyone please go go check out yektan go check out meatball man especially meatball man uh, yeah check out meatball man Forget Yektan, he's a piece of shit. He's not real. He okay, is. I'm gonna take a quick pause from the common turn stuff to do the cult of person. Oh no, I still can't do cult of personality. I'd have a couple days left. Uh, how are we cult doing industry wise? Can't do the five year plan yet. I will. Okay, I'm gonna start doing occasional things in the other sections to um, uh, improve our military and economy. I'm going to start, start with economy first. By founding the PDCI, um, which will is necessary to go down other military economy routes. Mm. All right, here we 
go. Right. Radio interception group. Excellent. Very nice. That means I can... Uh, oh, I need to complete it. Complete agency upgrade. We'll do that one more time. Japan has about a year left before we're able to uh, fully crack what is, I believe, the pur it's called the Purple Machine or the Purple Cipher. Maybe we can warn America about Pearl Harbor and they can just continue to do nothing about it. Also, Japan is having a little bit of a harder time uh, going forward in China than previously thought. Uh, Shaanxi is has seem seemingly recropped up. Uh, still, I mean, overall Japan is mostly kicking ass, but they're having a little bit of a harder yeah. time than they did originally. Alas, they you mean in real life? In real life, yes, in real life. Hey, Zook, how's it going? We're being Soviets. Zook, uh, Zook, make sure you're also checking out Meatball Man too. If you're not checking out Meatball Man, I'm gonna kill you in real life. Wait, don't don't kill Zook. Yeah. yeah, Zook's the only good one. Right right we have founded the PDCI. Oh, uh, non-aggression pact from Communist China. Let's accept that. Okay. Please tell me when you accepted that. I already got it. Awesome. Uh, uh, PC of mechanical engineering. Strengthen the. I'm trying to see what I should go down here. Okay, I'm gonna strengthen the mobilization plan. That will also give us some more options. Then I'm gonna jump back uh, to. I'm gonna see if I can jump back to political stuff once that's done. Okay. Cool. Uh, Varwim, hello, welcome. How are you doing? Oh no, that's someone on Meatball's stream. Meatball, there's someone on your stream. Varim, oh. Varim one. Hello, Varim. How are you? Grim. Thank you for tuning into the stream. We are being super Soviet. <clears throat> we are. True. Research slots are available. I hate politics and my heart is of iron game. Yeah, no, true. Oh, yeah. thank you. Thank you for the follow. Hey, hey yeah. let's go. Yep. This is part Look of an extended This is part of an extended series, so at least once a week you'll be able to see more of us dicking around together in various Soviet themed games. Uh is anybody getting the research right now? Oh, okay. I got it. Yeah, he's, right. he's doing that. Uh Diplomacy, let me see. Uh come in turn, no. Uh Asia. Uh where is Communist China? We have Do we want to ask for Do we want to ask for military and docking access with Communist China or do we not should we not bother? <laughs> it, it doesn't really matter. That's fair. Um I am going to reach out to regular China oh. and improve Ooh. relations with them. Your your collaboration government has been completed. Good. Uh, should I improve relations with regular China? Don't don't even worry about that. We need to save. Okay. Our again. Again. Uh, that's why I'm asking. Yep. Dude, go ahead. All right. So you got your. Uh, I'm gonna next... move. I'm gonna move my spy people back. I need a. I need some let time. Let me let me get the spy thing while you go go ahead and get the uh, national focus. Okay. I can do both, because National Focus is only going to take, like, a second. It's all good. Uh, can't do Stalin yet, that's annoying. Or can't do Stalin, can't do Cult of Personality. In which case, start upgrading other things. Transpolar Flights. There we go. Alright, and you have a, a slot to be able to be used. In what? In Spies? Yes. Okay, that's good. I will jump over then to uh, machine in... No, I need to complete the government cipher school. We'll do that. We are no longer get the effects of understaffed bureaucracy. Fuck yeah, boys. All right, now okay, take so... a look at our stability and uh, war support now. Awesome, I see that. What did you do for... Um, uh, what did you do in spy shit? I just went ahead and add them, um, added them back to Germany. So if you want to, you can actually go ahead and probably restart another collaboration over the preparation. Should I do that now? Yes. Okay. And you want to knock these out as quickly as possible. Okay, I'm going to continue. We are no longer get the effects of Sieve Spanish gold reserves. So that's unfortunate. That but but okay. it's so I'm going to continue to do Sorge and uh, Bondarod. <gasps> First part of her last name is Bond. We have Soviet female Bond. So hey. I'm just I'm, I'm gonna go with it. This is 
James Bond, but Bond A became trans and B joined the Soviet Union, which... Based? Ba based? This one's going out to my second favorite podcast, Kill James Bond. Alright, you have... I see it, don't worry. I'm just... The big thing is I'm just waiting to see when... Oh! Finally, we can do Cult of Personality. There we fucking go. Okay. We have uh, doctrines available. Government cipher school is done. Uh, let me see. So we can do machine assisted oh. assisted encryption, which will make it harder for us to be infiltrated. Very nice. Do ah. not worry about the um. Uh, what the hell is it? Yeah. Doctrine thing. Okay. Yet. Do we want to be churning out extra extra units yet? Um. Uh, we had some airplanes in reserve, so I put them into an air group and that's assigned good. it to our... That uh, is good, yeah. That is very good, Jack. Jack, you, uh, I do want to say you should manage the air stuff. I am managing the air it, stuff. Relatively well, so I'm not going to... Yeah, um, uh, so Thank if, you. if you mostly manage air stuff, I and Meatball can deal with land stuff as once the war breaks out. <laughs> T-50 chassis, that's good. Uh, Probably design some uh, uh, new yeah. stuff soon once we get once we get our military uh, factories. Yep. Or uh, once we get our military factories up and running. Uh, yep. No. Yeah. We, we are so uh, begin to start to uh, a bunch of our civilian factories are oh, are the being repurposed. Hell ye. The Germans claimed memo. Yeah. You know what that means? If they claimed memo, that means that. Uh, we are that means that they might be they might start world war ii on time what is it 19? oh yeah okay so a question do you want me to potentially do something that will do the split poland with germany or no yes okay i yeah pa you know what? Let's pa try pause for that. a second pause for a second how do i go about doing that do i need to approach germany a uh, Molotov Ribbentrop pack, which I think I already uh, accepted. Okay, if you've okay, if they you... will come to us. They should come to us. Okay, if that is, hopefully they do. If they don't, we don't because should. unfortunately, because unfortunately, if we don't do that, then they get all the way across Poland, and we don't want that. Yeah, that is very bad because that, that is. is... It's it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world, but if we're on, but if we can avoid it, if we can avoid it, it's good. Though. Also, we uh, another thing we have we don't really have a lot of supplies on the Poland or uh, yeah we don't really have a lot of uh, supply logistics on the Polish side. Should yeah. we start here's building the there? Yes. Wait, wait, wait. Here's here's the thing. Yes. Something else is that uh, the further away Germany is from the capital, the less supplies you're gonna have. So the closer we are to it. That is that is true, but I still think if we can split Poland with them, we should. <sighs> Here's the thing: we should just right now build up, uh, also intersperse uh, forts up to level like I think it's seven. Okay. Um and AA. Okay, so in I'm also bordering. Okay, yeah, uh, so states and I'm provinces. also doing freedom of. Oh. The Oh, you finished. And that would that would say so it's just like forts, uh, okay. Yes, forts like this. Yeah, so you you place AA, forts. Like... So another thing here, um so I just did freedom of debate, unity of action, which will help our political shit. Another thing here, I am going to go down Baltic security so we can start claiming um uh uh so we can start claiming um things, including because ideally we want to start cl making claims to the baltic and get those three states which historically that's what happens and that gives us more land that we can use to encircle the german forces in the east you're saying right. encircle where you're going to hold them we want to wear them down yeah. I, I I understand that it'll be easier to do that if we get those three Baltic states, because they might have... be overextending ourselves. Not really. It's just well, because here's the thing: if we don't do that, they're going to push up into those states anyway. The front line will be about the same either way. Is the thing. 
And also, it grants right. us the resources from those areas. Uh, Varium, we are trying to not be killed by Stalin's paranoia. Yeah. I under great. I understand that. I'm just saying that I'm probably going to go down and do some stuff for Baltic security next. Uh, which will um, help us there, is all I'm saying. I know we're trying not to... No, try not to be killed by Stalin's paranoia is I'm working on that right now, currently. No, no. Bari literally just asked me that. But I'm joking. We are trying to not die. We're the cabinet, remember? Okay, understood. No, I, yep. I, I know that. I'm just, I, I'm just, I'm just trying to describe to you guys what my next priorities are. I'm probably gonna jump over and. Start going down the Baltic tree. Oh, Varm is making a mod. What kind of mod are you making? Varm, yeah, what mod are you making? A special mod. Special. <gasps> hey, cryptology. I'm going to quickly jump over and start doing more operation stuff. Uh, portable radios. There we go. Mala Smog just redeemed Ask a Transit question. Oh, what is your thoughts on the magnetically miles? propulsed trains? I know a bit of your thoughts on contemporary trains, but not magnet trains. So maglevs, as they are called, I think can be incredibly useful. I think that um, <clears throat> the problem is, is that it, well, because it's specialized in new technology, building them new is kind of expensive, but there's areas where they can be useful and honestly, they can be used on so many more things than people give them credit for. Like, people think that they're mostly good for long-distance trains, but um, China has a maglev line in Beijing that is part of their metro. It accelerates faster, runs faster, stops faster. It's actually kind of great for that. So I think that maglev technology is worth pursuing. I do think that for countries that are far enough behind, conventional rail is more important at least to start, because conventional rail can be a lot more flexible, but maglev lines, I think, are overall good. We just need to be considerate and careful about where we're placing them. Uh, yeah. At least to start. But uh, overall, maglevs are pretty pog. Japan and China have been making great strides with them overall. Japan more so. Germany was making great strides, but they had, like, a single accident on their otherwise flawless test track, and they just abandoned everything. I don't know if that has been reversed yet. I think that's a huge mistake, because Germany was making some fucking incredible progress on maglevs. And mm -hmm. I'm disappointed that that has been, uh, you know, undone. Uh, should I start queuing for military factories now, or...? Um, not yet. Not yet. Okay. Let's see how we're we doing on construction. Should we put some supply hubs on? Uh, oh no, they're good. Okay. Supply hubs also take forever to build. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, I am going to start doing more. Fate of Czechoslovakia. So much for peace. Independent. Oh, Slovakia is independent yep. under Tizo. Czechoslovakia is no more. Act. Freedom of debate, unity of action. That is good. Uh. Construction of communism. So, another big question here. Uh, can we pause briefly? Yes. So, an important thing here by the bottom of the uh, Soviet Union focus tree. I can go down Faithful Servant of Lenin or Inheritor of the Mantle of Lenin. Faithful Servant of Lenin gives us base stability, uh, decreases our cost of guaranteeing other countries, and is defense against ideology drift. And it leads to ban excessive hero worship, which uh, um, makes Stalin a little bit more stable and decreases the cost of diplomacy decisions. Um, it also leads and allows us to do... Uh, I guess it allows us to do a next important split later on. Whereas if I do um, Inheritor of the Mantle of Lenin... It makes Stalin have more political power gain and justify war goals faster and leads to brilliant genius, which makes Stalin uh, give extra support for uh, national science things and increases our research speed. 
Hmm. So I go down one route, which rains Stalin in and improves our overall diplomacy and stability. The other one makes us better at war and increases research stuff. Which should which should I aim for? Hmm. Hmm. So the faithful servant was the one that's going to bring him in, right? A little bit. Um. He honestly, we, we we can mega rein him in. An option both both allow us to eventually do leader of the party and the people, which will also help rein him in. But inheritor mm -hmm. of the mantle of Lenin does a little bit less to rein him in at the start. That's that's. The other thing is, in order to do this, we need to do we need to carry out five propaganda campaigns, which needs to happen in decisions. If we want to do either of those, yes. Let's go down the inheritor, inheritor of the mantle of Lenin. Okay, are we? Are, is that what we're doing? Yes. You sure? Okay, so yeah, I can't I, I can't do that right. I can't do that right now, but I'll aim for that. Okay, and I'm going down Baltic Security. Awesome. All right, here we go. We're going again, so yeah, decisions. We want to do some propaganda campaigns. There's traits for military organizations, military industrial organizations. Uh, we can also modify the government again, but let's deal with the stuff we've already discussed first with political right. power. Okay, Japan is starting to make some big pushes now. Yeah, they're... Oof. Intelligence agency. Let me see. Diplomacy. Regular China. Uh, should I send an attache to regular China? No. Not yet, anyway. Okay. Should I improve relations? Go ahead, yeah, that's not a bad idea. Okay, we're doing that. That will also probably, yeah, any, because we're going to want to... They're going to need our help. Communist China, we're already chill with. Communist China, setting an attache there could also be good. Long run, not right <laughs> now, because we're still trying to build up and setting an attache is a lot, but... Xinjiang is... yeah. Ah, oh, fuck, Albania. Albania Ew. is now Italian. Oh, boy. Uh, do we... Where is Xinjiang? There we are. Um, awesome. Do So, we'll also need to start talking about whether or not we want to lend lease to anyone in China. We don't need to do that now, but I think it's worth considering. Fine. Do no. you want to go ahead and get to National Focus? I'm doing that right now. Awesome. Yeah, yeah, pushing our claims in Baltic so we can make headway there. Okay. Yeah, because we need we need to get propaganda stuff done before I can go down the rest of the Stalin tree. Computing machines, fuck yeah. We have the machine that can poot. I love pooping. Mom, get out of my room. I'm playing how to properly go ahead and calculate where I should fire my artillery. Oh, uh, the forts. Uh, okay, so you've placed the forts. I'm going... The forts are actually getting done really quickly, so I'll leave the forts where they are for now. Both ciphers have been decrypted. Excellent. Good work. Uh, oh! Collaboration government has been completed. Mm-hmm. Uh... Want to do it again? <laughs> yes. Keep keep doing it until it's done on your opening. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. What? Sit, sit, sit. what is it? Sign the treaty. You want to do the thing to get half of Poland? Sign yes. the treaty. Do it, do it. Okay. We're going to make Poland our buffer. Okay. I'm going to continue preparing the collaboration government with Germany. Commence when ready. Prepare. 
Oh, Germany. Do you we are getting, relations getting with, uh, fucking infiltrated. Do we relations with Poland or no? Why? We're, we're, we're about to take them over. Oh, okay. Never mind. I'm going to continue upgrading that stuff. For the Just spies. Just stop training the, uh, the Air Force so that they can actually start doing missing missions. Well, remember, um, you, you're going to want to give them a moment to breathe as well before. Yeah. Uh, let well, me tell me when to stop, so... Do that now. Yeah, stop their training so they can breathe and get their resources in order. Mm -hmm. yeah. Also, let me know... Also, uh... Let me... If you want me to, tell me where we can, um... You know... Uh... If, if we want to start producing military... More military units... Um, we're still trying to get our existing shit together. Understood. But we're like two years away, potentially, or less, from having to fight the crowds. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Where is... So they are there, spies. Bye. Okay, they are there. Sexcellent. Excellent. They are pairing collaboration government. I love collaborating government. I know that the... Okay, so another thing is you guys... Again, so if you want me to crack Japan's cipher, you tell me whenever. No enemy ciphers being decrypted. Are there any other nations that I should decrypt right now? Italy. Might as well. Okay, sure. Get all the access. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Wunderbar. Okay. It is just we're getting okay. um, not too far away from fulfilling all of our yep. logistical requirements to our troops. Yep. Also, okay. uh, let the, um, uh, um... What's it called? Uh, let no, the... No, we need more, we need more supply to uh, uh, refuel the yeah. plane. I'd say unpause when you're ready. I would also say that when we split Poland, is it split the same way every time, or is it split based on what we conquer? It should split the same way every time. Okay, because okay, if it was split based on the way we conquer, I would say we would want to not make that salient. But if it's split the same way every time, then that's fine. Continue. And unpause when you're ready. I'm going to run to the piss room real quick. All right. So we unpause or no? Me pull? Sure. All right. All right. Watch them go. Here's the thing. We might even just be able to just sit on the Germans, kill them all. Mm hmm And let the Poles kill the Germans. As many of them as possible. Right. My planes are not refueling. I think we need more air supply. What do you mean, air supply? Well, take uh, take a look at our planes right now. Oh, no, okay, no, never mind. They're resupplying. Yeah, it's because we have shit. It's just gonna yeah, fucking it's supply. Gonna, yeah, it's just. just and we need to increase supply. our railway numbers, which we're we're doing. Mm-hmm. Gotcha. How's that mm. going? Oh. There you go. Sansa. Hello, Zanza. The answer, Panzer. Zanza is fucking me. Yay, thank you. Zanza. Welcome back. Welcome back. I have invisible ink. Very nice. Great, the world's on fire. 
How about yours? That's the way I like it, and I'll never get bored. Uh, let's see, should we go for quality assurance routines? Yep. Huh? Uh, for, uh, Morozov Design Bureau. What? No, oh, never mind. Design Bureau? Yep, Design Bureau. Uh, okay. I have been should doing we, those. Should we get a air warfare theorist? Okay. Do you um, want to do mili uh, air supremacy? Okay, um, so get the close air support. Close air support. Check check in decisions uh, about um, uh, um, sending ult sending ultimatum to Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania. Check that. Yep. I'm making let's claim. Start with. Let's start with Latvia. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Choo choo. The twins, they go chugga chugga choo choo. Yep. I'm working on the claims for Bessarabia as well. Joe mm -hmm. Bessarabia. <laughs> uh, should Shut I up. move? Should I move the planes in the far, uh, the far east over to where we are? Not all of them, but some of them, because Japan. We move. Most of them, yeah. yeah. Okay. Make sure there's still a decent enough force there that we can fight Japan. Sh should I take the bombers? Should I move the bombers over there? Yeah, most yeah. of them, not all of them, but... Well, I mean, I only have two bombers, so... Mm. We still have the 200 fighters over there, so... Mm -hmm. God, Zuko's so fucking good. You're good. Dude, he's got an attack of five. Mm. <laughs> okay. Moving him over. This guy is nuts. I can't quite finish the five-year plan yet. I don't think. Doctrines are available. Let me check. Uh, convoy inter uh, interdiction. Yeah. Yes. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I I need five more controlled factories. Yeah, we're at before forty-seven percent world tension before right now. Before I can finish, we're gonna want to finish the five-year plan for the sake of our economy, so we're ready. Mm-hmm. Oh, there, yeah, it there it is. Poland joined the okay. Allies. Germany has ignored every warning. So what do we do? We sit. Do we let them attack? Okay. Oh, Nanjing has fallen. Nothing bad is going to happen there. Oh, no. Yeah, so we're doing claims on Assarabia. Mm-hmm. Uh, I will... Potentially go best Arabia. After that, do you want me to demand Eastern Poland? Do you want me to demand Eastern Poland or nah? Hello? Yes. Okay, so I should do that next. Okay. Yes? Yes. Okay, making sure. Uh, it seems like we don't have enough manpower equipment to fill our garrisons. They don't worry about that. That's. Okay. Actually, speaking of which. Let me do this. Where are we building our garrisons? Um. Oh, over there. I see. Okay. Okay, I'll do that next. Yeah, we need. I need to build five more factories. So I'm gonna move factories up the chain a little bit. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. just, just put five up there. So if I click like I'm a, um, the number up, I can cue how many are being built. At if you time. shift, uh, yes. Don't do that. You want to have them built uh, parallel rather than sequentially. Otherwise, it's going to take way longer. So, right. so what, what does that just mean? Have them all done at, just have five. them all done at the same time. Okay, Two so scuds. move them all up. Okay. Just move five up. How do I move five up at once? You, you can't, but you can go ahead and you can shift left click mm. the up arrow button and it'll put it all the way to the top. Okay. Sorry. Okay, I'll do that. I'm gonna set close. Luxembourg is capitulated. German pressure towards Benelux. German Reich has declared war. 
cut. So sh shift up, shift up. We're about to face off against the Adolf Hitler. We're getting ready. Yep. Yeah. Flames on Bessarabia, awesome. Moving to uh, demand Eastern Poland. Or has Poland already capitulated? Oh, Poland is not already capitulated, okay. I'm actually gonna move our air uh, yep. our air units near a uh, airplane that's near. Bessara Soviet Union claims Bessarabia. Nice. Uh, oh yes, we got Bessarabia. Good work, boys. Also check out the Baltics. Yep, I see that. Good. Um, later. So I could also go for the Balkans, but we a we don't want to overstretch, and b um, I want to jump to economic and military stuff ASAP because time yeah. is time is running out. For large airframe. Uh. I can get air transports. Should we invest in air transports? No, that's way no. too expensive. We need to focus on just fixing our basic shit first. Yes. All right. Do we have bombers yet? No? Okay. Yeah. Hmm. They yep. just suck, which, again, we can't even build them too much because we need to focus on the basic stuff first. Yep. Warsaw yeah. has fallen. And we're building a shit ton of civilian factories. This is good. Poland has capitulated. Are we getting uh, canceled? Are we not getting any of it? No. Oh, they didn't get any of it, son of a bitch. That's fine. That's fine. It's annoying, though. Okay, do you want to reform the front lines, then? Well, we need to see if we can take Lithuania, then. Yes, important. Hmm. Again, we should have a bit of time. Okay, we'll I am... Going... Oh, yeah, there we go. Here, I am going to next... Uh... Yadolf, Hitler. Yes, finish the five-year plan. Yes. Okay. Netherlands has capitulated uncertain times. We live in uncertain times. We do. Are we... Are we... Do you want us to build any more units yet? Oh, there we go. We got oh, it. Well. Hey. Okay, adjust the front lines. Again, we don't need to worry about it at this moment. I am. Okay, yeah, so I'm so because we're probably gonna lose some of that land immediately, I'm not gonna extend rail lines there yet. Yeah, let it actually if you extend the rail lines, it might actually be bad for us because that means the Germans will have intact rail networks to actually yeah transport their shit through. Yeah, um, I'm a uh, most of the rail lines that I have, I see our old front lines by the forts. I may Look at that. I may drag hey. a, I may drag a rail line all through them. In order to like better connect That's those. That's not forts. a bad idea. Yeah, mm -hmm. which is, uh, yeah. Again, mimicking what the Germans did on the Eastern Front in World War One, like their rail network there, super well designed and dense. Right. Yeah. Like you can see how dense it is in Poland, and that's largely because of the Germans. <laughs> yeah. Whereas there's a, there's a couple gaps in some areas. Uh, Lviv, Stanislav. Uh, okay. Yeah, uh... So we're just gonna play full defensive? Largely, yes. Um... Start. Right. Uh, also, mm -hmm. um, our boy, uh, Yekis. Yes. Make sure you're ready with planes to move, um... So, there's some planes in Dnepro Pretrotsk. You may want to move those closer to the Germans. Gotcha. Just because uh, they're kind of far away right now, and the closer they are, the sooner we can whittle away their air force. Where's that? 
It's the it's the one just north of Sevastopol. In you, it's the one in Ukraine right now. Dnipro Petrovsk. Oh, okay, okay. oh yeah, those guys. Yeah. Uh, Europe. Let me see how our buddies Romania are doing. Kingdom of Romania, mostly democratic, but there's a growing. They're fascist. growing fascist. They're they growing are. fascist. They're gonna go that way. Yeah, they're probably gonna go that way. Do you want me to bother with them at all or no? Don't really. Okay. Any anything else you think we should do diplomatically right now? Not really. Okay, just making sure. Okay. Uh, production. Go. Okay, the factories are gonna finish relatively soon, which is good. Moving bombers. The fall of Paris. Oh, oh no. they, they got to they Paris faster anyway. than expected. Uh oh. In 39. Yeah, in 39. Well. Oh, there's Vichy France. Free France is capitulated. Uncertain times. The death yeah, of Hesse. Rudolf Heste died when Rudolf intercepted Hesser. the heavy fighter of his mission remains unclear. Hesse was an accomplished pilot. Period of arms and remains were recovered by British authorities. State funeral with an empty coffin has been scheduled in Berlin. Visibly distraught by the death of his old friend. Well, he tried to leave. Ah, oh, that was a famous incident. The strange death of Rudolf Hess. Came by to give Moshe some love. That's your first mistake. You should be giving meatball love. Yeah, give meatball love. You should be loving the balls. Mm -hmm. True. The balls harden. They do. Uh, let's do localized training centers. I am, I am Spymaster, it's true. Ooh, okay. not good. Uh, I, looks like you're moving our armed forces, yeah. Do I have a yeah. link to Meatballs? Attached. I don't I have a link. Again, uh, if you can go on Twitch and look up Meatballs' name, it should come oh, up. I'll, I'll type his name in there. I'm going to type his name in our chat real briefly so you can just copy-paste. Very nice. So it's meatball double underscore man. Copy paste that, and you should find him. Moshe de Moshe, yes, the answer. Communist China has Yep. Yeah. We expect. Glorious it. to communist oh, yep. China. Oh, there goes, there goes Japan. Yep. Yeah. Japan is more successful in China than they were uh, in real life. Damn. I love how Denmark mm -hmm. just instantly fold. Third War in Norway, White Peace, finish the five-year plan, see how the situation develops. Uh, select a national focus. I'm gonna... Okay, we want to... I'm gonna try to finish the third year, the third five-year plan first. That becomes locked when we enter a war against a major power, so I'm gonna try to get that done now. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna... What other spy shit can I do right now? Our intelligence agency is going through the fucking roof. I'm gonna go for the Air Force Department now. Oh no, the Germans are, uh, being, um, uh, re... The Germans have re-encrypted. Hmm. Fortunately. Oh god, uh, and our guy, Sorge, was forced into hiding. I think they must have been found... Briefly, yes. Sorge's in hiding. The the operation was not a success, but the good news is no one died. The first two were, yeah. though, right? The first two were fine. Yeah. Oh, uh, Zook says good day, hey, all thanks, of Meat Man. Hey. How are you, Zook? Oh, Zookus of Fukus. Meet uh, Zook, if you're not following him, you should follow him. I think he is. I don't know if, if he was, he would have had the link. We've had the balls. We've had the balls. The ball stretcher. The balls harden. The straw betcher. Beatball man. The Joe Besser. Okay. Uh, 18 divisions, 18. So do we want... So I see one of our army divisions is quite stretched. Oh. No, never mind. It's not as stretched. You, no, yeah. Um, one of our... One of our divisions looks a little bit... That's Army 8, Army 6, okay, never mind, they're not as stretched as I thought. Idiot Moshe. Air Force Department research done. Uh, 
Nikolai. Okay, that's our... Yeah, the Econ guy is in. Kalinin is in. Do we want to put in a research theorist? Um... Yeah, close, uh, close air. But we need to wait until 150. Yeah, well, well I mean, I'm talking about for this one because research in general, so I can only... The thing is, that will cancel out our ability to get another theorist that might be better. Hmm. What do you guys think? I'm asking Yetball. Almost any of those could be good options, but, you know. Um... For military staff, we could actually pro uh, probably put in close air support. I was gonna say, get um, get the Sergei Rudenko. Okay, for, okay, so okay, so we'll do close air, but we need to wait till we. Do you want us to just spend the 150 and fuck it, or yeah, wait a little bit longer? Okay, there's not much we have to spend on right now. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Now you're putting in Sergei gotcha, gotcha. Uh, Rudenko. Also, yeah, we got... So, yeah, our border is nice and tight there. That's good. We may want to also put in some defenses in, uh... In, like, in what was old, uh, Latvia. Sorry, not old Latvia. Old Lithuania. It's, like, around Kaunas and Vilnius. Just because we have, we have our defensive line on the old border. There's not a lot of defensive lines to the north, though. Right. Selecting a national focus. Increase... Uh, my... My plan right now is basically to go ahead and hold out there and then fall back to the old line. I'm improving the railway now. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Um, but we still we still want to have at least. But we need to. Pl There's a gap in our defense network where the old line was because of the Baltic states. So we want to make sure we plug that gap first. Also, I assume sure. isn't there. Uh... No, go ahead, take a look at forts. Oh no, you built it up there. Okay, never mind. Oh wow. Okay, so a quick note. I assume that in the economic sense we want to go. Uh, there's a. I can choose national specialists or foreign experts. I assume I want to go. Um, uh, yeah, I, I assume I want to go down national specialists. Uh, where is it? Focus tree, economy all the way on the left. National specialists versus foreign experts. One, in, one enhances construction speed, the other enhances research more. I'm wondering if um, I should give the bombers a escort of fighters. Yeah, get the um, national specialist. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'll go down that next. Yeah, so it's just that now that the five-year plan thing was completed, I'm just trying to speed all these things before the war starts. Yeah. Because there, there's a couple options here that I really need to try to get done before T34. that war starts. T-34, T-34. Also, another big one there, eventually, I can choose between reorganizing... The PC, uh, the People's Council of Heavy Industry, which will uh, um, in, uh, increase research bonus for industry and electronics. Or I can shift to armaments production, which will increase the speed of military factories and research bonus for infantry weapons. Also, the German cipher has been decrypted again. You guys tell me if you want to research that. If you want me to unlock the German one, yes. Not, not at least until we're born. Okay, so should I go down? I assume we're going to want to shift to armaments production rather than reorganize the heavy industry. Um, yeah. Yeah, and the thing is, that's important because that becomes locked once we enter a war against a major power. Actually, give me one second. Do, we, do you want to pause while you're looking at that? No. Hungary joined the Axis. Yeah, that's... Go, go ahead down the uh, shift to armaments production. Okay, I'm going to do that now because that becomes locked once we enter a major war, so I'm going to do that now. Yeah, 
Yeah, we are we're, we are racing against the fucking clock here. Yep. Uh, double check everything. If there's something that you guys think you see that no one's doing yet, shout about it. Our war support is at 99%. This is good. The Soviet people want a war. That's bad. What's bad? Available planes and reserves. Bulgaria joined the Axis. It's not the end of the world, but again, it's... Not it's great. Not great, yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, that is also historically what happened. Yep, Romania joined the Axis. Port. Yeah. Well, I'm glad we got Bessarabia, then. Yeah, so we're gonna need to start putting up front lines down in Romania and Hungary, too. Here's the thing, we can't do a front line against more than one nation. It'll have to be a fallback line. Well, not for a single line, but if we had another, we could put another, ar if we had another army group, <laughs> we, we, could, we could put it there. We, we can't spare any. Well, I know, we sh should we be making more? We can't even truly fulfill it for, like, demands. No, not yet. Soon, because we're fulfilling them very quickly. Yeah, we're gonna Zoom. we're gonna want to do it soon, and we're also gonna potentially not totally worry if our demand if our the demands aren't totally filled, just because you know. Well, it will cripple demand our demand, Besser. I will cripple you. Whoa! Uncalled for. Okay. okay, Italy's cipher has been decrypted, so I can uh, I can unlock any access ciphers right now. German, Japan, uh, Italy. Officer core can also be adjusted. I love listening to the little trains. Chugga, 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 chugga. Okay, theorist, I am adding close air support. There we go. Research is done. How's our construction going? Chewing through the forts, that's good. Yep. Just tell me when we need to start uh, building military factories. Yep. I am working on increasing our capacity for that. Good. Research slot available, military industrial organization available. Shift to armaments production is almost ready. Uh, uh, which will, in yeah, it's, which means we'll be able to construct military factories a shit ton faster. There we go. Okay, that's good. That can only be done in the, like, prior to war. There's stuff that I need to run down and get now while I can. I will do yeah. next, uh, steel casting. Yeah, I'm going down the econ stuff because we're, like, less than a year out to war right now. Excavation's been done. That's good. It is also currently just past 11 p.m. Oh, in real time. Good to know. All right, yeah, we got planes and reserves. That's you. Yep, start dispersing them. Another note here, um, because our front lines may fall... You may not want them to be in um, in airfields that are right close to the border, but like one level back. Okay. For example, the one that is, like, you see how way in the south you have one near uh, Poskuriv? That's good. The one in Lvov is very close to the front line. So if we lose Lviv, we lose all those planes, for example. Mm -hmm. So you may want to move, like, so that one and... Uh, the one up north in Baltistock, uh, or Bail, however yeah. the fuck you pronounce it. Move those back. Not You don't have to move them back super far. We still want them close to the front lines, but that might oh, be no, too we, close. I have these, I have these to the, um, to our, uh, I have them attached to our army, so I'll okay. detach them from the army if I move back. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, just because we, uh, we're going to want to get ready to fucking... Yeah, they're supporting our front line. Oh, right now. oh, okay. Yeah, just, just, just as a note, because if we lose those airfields, we risk losing yep. them. So just be, uh, be careful with that. 
I'll have most of our bombers in the back, though. Okay. Look at the beautiful Moshe Rail Network. Soviet Volunteer Group. 11 days left. Awesome. <laughs> volunteer in big quotation marks. Okay. Uh, operations are about to be maxed out. Our spy agency is going to be ready to do some fucking shit, man. Uh, yeah. I cannot... Okay, so I can't infiltrate the government. Do you want me to infiltrate the army? Sure. Or steal industrial blueprints? Um, infiltrate the army. Infiltrate the army. I am going to send... Oh! Natasha is now level 2. She's great. I'm going to send Natasha, job, Natasha and Kuzma. Cosmo. Uh... Poison for Cosmo. Not Cosmo, Cusco. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not real. No, nobody knows. Uh, right, bombers are ready to bomb. Hey, Moshe, why aren't you real? You know, it's the whole uh, Kentucky meme. Yeah, shut up. Hey, Moshe. Hey, Moshe. We have free dockyards. It, it put them towards, again, subs and destroyers. Subs, destroyers, and or... Uh, do docks affect naval trade? Uh... Zansa so? says, Uwu, welcome to tiny trains. Yes, the tiny trains are good. Steel casting industry, tabbing, yeah, getting as much done as I can. Uh, oil production... Do you want me to do oil production or synthetic rubber, or should I just skip right down to production lines? Just go down to production lines. Yep. C4. I'm just trying to do that as quickly because I'm, uh, yeah, uh, okay, so once that's done, okay, I will basically have our industry secured for the war once that is done. And then I'll, mm -hmm. I'll, ju I'll see if I can jump into oil production and synthetic rubber afterwards. Yep, and yep, we have planes again. Actually, I should also increase state reserves first. Uh... Modify five-year plan resource efficiency by 10% and adds fuel silos. Now I gotta carefully decide what everything we're doing here. Air groups. Hey, okay, how is how's the supply of our boys looking? Decent. Uh, pretty heckin' decent. Okay. We can actually... Yeah, if you want to start recruiting, dump them in Minsk and Kiev. D yeah, dump them there and then start organizing them either for a front line against Hungary and a front line against Romania, or also just like extra front lines to the front. Mm -hmm. Improve infantry equipment, that's good. Should probably uh, okay. while you're start doing while you're doing that. Do you want me? Uh, is there something you would like me to research? I got it. Okay. End of the League of Nations. Yeah, there it goes. Okay. Go. Okay. Okay. Uh. See. Greece is. Oh, the United Kingdom has conquered Albania. <laughs> Italy already oh, lost. No. Italy... It, no, Italy already lost Albania. That's really good for us. Because hmm. it means that the Allies are severely seems like weakened. Things, it seems like things are happening like five years earlier than usual. More like one year earlier. One year um, earlier. Uh, so, no, so remember, um, so in real life, Britain. Sorry, Italy was Italy and Germany were able to conquer all of Greece. Britain mm -hmm. has taken Albania and is in Britain is invading Sardinia. That's really good, actually. Britain's doing exceptional this game. Italy is already losing territory. Bulgaria, good job, Italy. Bulgaria, and uh, the, the Axis are about to swallow Yugoslavia, though. Nice job, Italy. But again, here's the thing. Fucks. The British are already there and supporting Greece. That is exceptionally good. So that is... We've had some setbacks, but this is actually a historic thing that didn't happen that's going in our favor. 
And looking at what we're up against, our forces compared to the Germans are looking pretty good there. Optimize production lines. Excellent. Go. Change. Oh, the Turkey canceled the non-aggression pack. Fuck you, Turkey. You're not even real. Uh, I'm not going to worry about the Red Fleet. I am going to... Uh... Uh, should I start making interwar air larger frames? Uh, I'm going... Again, don't worry too much okay, about Okay, I answer. am doing military engineering, so we'll be able to build forts faster. King Karl of Romania is gone. That's bad. That is bad, but expected. Research slot open, and uh, officer core can be modified. Alright, so the way that I have my plane set up is that they're mostly going to be... Uh, fortif or helping fortify near like uh, Krakow fuck. and there goes there Lubin. goes Ben there goes Yugoslavia okay the the British were, the British were forced out of Sardinia and they're about to be forced out of Albania so we, we, we will have cost them some time and resources which is good but it looks like they're still gonna they're gonna get their thing oh yeah Yugoslavia's done you're done Yugoslavia you're fucking done Again, historic. Yes. But I was impressed there. The British landing in Albania and Sardinia, that did not happen. Mm, yep, there we go. Yugoslavia capitulated. Uh, the, there's a fight. Free Norway versus Fascist Norway. Uh, Fascist Norway... Free Norway and Fascist Norway are having a pretty even fight right now. I assume the Fascists will win. But Free Norway is seemingly pushing them back. Uh, should we get a uh, naval aviation uh, specialist? Hey, don't need to worry about that. That, if that is aircraft carriers. We don't need to worry about that. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, you you are. You are to planes. <laughs> you are you are to planes. What I am to trains. The yeah. least effective things we can currently do, unfortunately. True. Uh oh. This is like my second time playing this game, so... It's fine. No, it's not. Also, we have uh, armored vehicles that can be built. Nope. Oh. Uh, or a new, a new type of armored vehicle. Uh, do we want to start making T-34s? Um, I basically designed them. Okay. So if you want... Yeah. T-34, yep. Just make sure that we're... Yep. Make sure, because... Right now, we're still... We haven't gone into full military factory production yet, so be careful how you balance stuff. We have no divisions in basic training. That's because I just shit out 48. Yeah. I saw. Very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, yeah, split those up as best you can. Let me... Before I do anything else, I'm going to get them to at least basic yeah. level. That's fair. Training. Do you also want... Do we want to make some tanks so we can start shoving tank units or mechanized units? We're already units? making tanks. Okay, We're perfect. We're already making tanks. We're, we have a huge deficit of tanks. Okay, just making sure, buddy. I'm just... We're, we're making tankies. Don't worry. Oh, God. Let's not do that. Oh, I'm sorry, Zanza. Teeny tiny trains. Welcome to tiny trains. Welcome. Welcome to tiny train town. Okay. Uh, Just say the word and I'll start uh, or I'll start queuing up military factories. Only come inside, tiny train pussy. Mm. Have you ever thought about not saying things out loud? Okay, nope. our fort upgrades are almost done, and then we're back to infrastructure. I am... I am ready to bomb. Yeah, we are... It's 1941, so we're probably close to actually starting this shit. When we do start the war, I would or ask that we potentially earlier. kick it down to three instead of four yeah, speed, just cool. once the war starts. I'm also going to... I'm going to double-check our gale ways. Uh, that can be upgraded... Uh, 
equipment. That can be upgraded. Uh... Okay, and that can be upgraded. Oil production's done. Yep, National, do you want me to do synthetic rubber, or should I just skip that? Just, um, do, do it. Do it. Yeah, yeah, okay, so, okay so, so if I do that, I will have done every single thing that we can do that gets locked out when the war starts. So our economy will be on maximum footing. I'm going to shift back to political and military stuff after that. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, the British have finally been chased out of Albania. That's hilarious, though. Okay, infiltrate army has been completed. Finished. Outlook excellent. Uh, oh, and we're getting another spy in 26 days. Fuck yeah! Very nice. Okay, I am going to send them back to Germany. Alright, time to make another small basic airframe again. Okay, I'm going to send Sorge actually to Warsaw now to scan over there. And uh, Cosmo, I'm just going to call him Cosmo. Osmo, I'm sending to, uh... Should I actually send Cosmo to one of the other Eastern European nations like Hungary or Romania, or should I not bother? Focus mostly on Germany. Okay, I'm gonna send him to Frankfurt, then. The next guy I get, I'm sending to Japan. Cool. Both, uh... Okay, both yes. Soviet theaters should be full on fighters now. Also, we may want to make sure we have at least some troops ready by Manchuria. I I do. Uh oh, never mind. I had opened. A, I was in the wrong tab. Classic. Certified Moshe moment. Okay, I am going no, to. Yeah. What else can we do here? Uh, the Stalin line. Builds so uh, another choice I have. I can build the Stalin line, which improves forts in in Skov, Naval, Vitebsk, Minsk, Kiev, Odessa, or I can do the Molotov line, which is okay. So the Stalin line is around our old border. The Molotov line is around the new border, or at least a little bit closer there. Mm. They're mutually exclusive with each other. Do, okay, since we're already building up the old line, you might as well do the Molotov line. <laughs> since we'll do that, yes. Okay, okay new doctrine. New... Oh, we I have the army doctrine. Work. Let's see. Yep. Don't don't pick that one, remember? Operative can no, be wait. recruited. Uh, let's see. Well, no, this, no, this is an art, uh, land doctrine. This is a uh, special okay. That's why I said uh, don't do it, because that's okay. the one that we want to wait on. Okay, right. Should so I should send either... Kim Philby, who's an infiltrator and a double agent, or Ramon Merceder, who is an infiltrator and tough to Japan. Who should I prioritize? What was the other nationality? Philby double is agent. British. Oh, Ramon, yeah. Ramon is Spanish and Mexican. Uh, oh, wait, no. Meatball, what do you think? You do Ramon. Okay, I'm send, sending Ramon to Japan. I'm sending the Ramones to Japan. Hey. Oh, fuck. I can't believe we've done this. Oh! Oh! Let's go! <laughs> also, uh... Okay, I will inf... Uh, what next? Uh, Machine-assisted encryption. That's your decryption. So, because every now and then, they re-crypt their stuff slightly. That's fine, though. Uh, our ciphers are so good that we very quickly um, rediscover it. We have research open and doctrines are available. Is someone going through our doctrines? Uh, um, yeah, that's the Special Forces doctrines. We need to hold off on that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we got bombers itching to bomb. We got another aggression pack with Japan. Oh. 
Take okay. it, take it for now. Just take it for now. We can always break it later. Yeah, and I already already accepted that. That's a that's a yeah. huge win. That is good, yeah. Because so what really happened was they tried to invade the Soviet Union a little bit in 1939. Instead, they just totally fucked off. Hmm. Right. Also, Japan. If Japan doesn't attack the United States on time, they might actually be able to totally conquer China. Which you know, not good. Definitely not good for the Chinese. Yep. Well, Chinese people look Chinese. Generally speaking. You know, China... Generally speaking. So, Japan is doing overall better in the Eastern Theater right now than they did in the real timeline, which is not good. Okay. okay. Uh, let me see here. Uh, Machine-assisted decryption, next level. Let me double check our productions. Okay, we're going through, upgrading our infrastructure and making some civilian factories. Molotov line has been completed. What next? Uh, I am going to now go down PC of mechanical engineering. I'm just I'm do, I'm doing our military tech stuff right now, bit by bit. We are no longer oh, getting the effects of the mullet. Get ready, boys! Mm -hmm. Here we go. Get ready! It's gonna <laughs> happen. Pause for a minute. Yep, we're pausing for a minute. <laughs> will, will you? What? <laughs> okay. Where? Actually, I'm gonna be putting you guys, because... Turkey's not really doing jack shit right now, so I'm moving the Mountaineers to the Hungarian line. The Mountain Queers. That's me when I move to the Mount with my gay boys. Yes. Are we? That's us when we go to Montana. Twoo! Fax and Wajik. Oh, whoa. Oh, my fellas. Yeah? I said, yeah. Yeah, I said, yeah. Yep. Oh, uh, okay. Um, Bucket is explaining uh, World War One shotguns to uh, to airport. Good. Oh, in your chat. Yeah. No, in um, in in Discord. I just ta oh, I tabbed okay. over to check my Discord notifications. Okay. So here's the thing: when you unpause, if Germany invades, then I will ask to pause again. So. I can run to the bathroom, and so we can decide how you and I are splitting up taking care of infantry things. Yes. Also, so we can talk about if and if at that point we want to start churning out military factories, which we can do because military factories, we have the bonus that makes them even faster. And, and guess what else? What? We're almost already done with all of the uh, um, original stuff we were working on. Oh yeah. yeah. That is good, yes. And Which, again, we interspersed and delayed with a bunch of shit. Well, I mean, I still think it's good that we interspersed, because it meant that everything was getting done, you know? Well, that's how awesome we are. Because we, I, I, thought it was, I thought it was good to intersperse, because we needed rail done along with road, and we also needed civilian factories getting done fast, because otherwise, without that, if I had delayed the five-year plan any longer, we would not have been able to get half the shit done that we have, so that was good. Moshe Dale being just like one more lane, bro. One more train, bro. One more train, bro. <laughs> just one more train. Just one more train, bro. Okay. Uh, let me let us know when you're ready to unpause, and we'll see where we're at. If war, yeah. If war starts, pause again. But for right now, let's roll. Cancel non-aggression <laughs> pact. That's not auspicious at all. Once I'm done with mechanical engineering, I'm probably going to go down the next thing to let us do a defensive pact with the allies. I'm Gee, gonna, it's, I'm, it's I'm almost... Gonna yeah. I'm going to do something real quick. Yep. Um, what do we have in Germany right now? I'm actually going to go get a snack real quick. What do we have in Germany right now? I mean, spy... What do they do in Germany right now? Uh, currently, they are expanding their network. Uh, operations, I don't have anything yet. But I can prepare Capture Cypher, which I don't really need. 
Infiltrate Navy, Infiltrate Air Force, Make Resistance Contacts, Steal Industrial Blueprints, Steal Military Blueprints. Okay. I'm looking right now. You have at least one that doesn't have to be working on improving the network. Um, I have one of them. Yes. Actually, have it be, um, Cusco. Cusco, okay. Alright, have Cusco go ahead and... What is it here? Um, diplomatic pressure Germany. I'm gonna do a little sneaky. Okay, I'm gonna... Diplomatic pressure Germany? Yes. Okay, Vano's doing that. You're doing a little sneaky. A political paranoia is zero. Thank God. It's been that way for like two years. Yeah, I'm sorry, I didn't notice because I've I've been looking at normally I I'd be looking at decisions, but I'm not because you're you know. You're, China has canceled their non-aggression pact with us. China, we're literally trying to help you. Oh, oh boy, here we go. Okay. Uh, yeah. Next chance I get, I'm gonna start going down allied trees. China. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go down the allied trees and I'm gonna give development to some of our um, uh, Asian uh, people, so the Asian Actually, communists. Cancel. Asian people? What? Cancel that. Cancel that. Cancel what? Cancel it's, Asian it's, people. It's too far gone with Germany. That's fine. No diplomatic pressure. With... Okay. Right. So what, what should you do instead? I have 15, 14 days. What should I do? Um, just have him go ahead and keep building network. Okay. Yep, Germany's justifying against it. This is it. Okay. One more thing. I'm gonna put some radar stations down. Do that. Uh, kick him to the top of the tier. Oh yeah. So Japan. So the question is, will Japan do Pearl Harbor? Are they gonna drag America? If, are they gonna drag America into this? Are they gonna drag these nuts? Greece has not been conquered yet. That's pretty incredible. Well, I guess Germany just ain't gonna help yet. Oh! Germany let Italy have a lot of Yugoslavia. Norm and historically, they didn't do that. That's probably why. That's why they haven't conquered Greece yet. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's good, that's good, that's good. Um... Yeah. Also, we'll want to start producing units in case Germany decides to land units somewhere. Which they might not do, but I've seen them do it before. That's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and train one whole additional army. I'm gonna put it on actually half an army on low priority, but I'm gonna have at least three in um what is it se sequence? Yes. Having them built at Moscow. Yes. DC of Mechanical Engineering has some more days to do. That's also good because I need we need control of Moscow for that, and probably not gonna lose that, but would still be if we didn't. Okay. I'm building up the force yep. on the main line. Also, hopefully they haven't gotten too much intel on us because I have good anti I, I I've I've had good counterintelligence ops. Very good. And right now we out no with our far our units are better than they would have been historically at this time and the germans and we're actually ready for them this time which means that i think we're gonna we should have an easier time than the soviets did in real life it's because we're more based than stalin yeah <laughs> I mean, to be fair, that's what happened in real life. So much of the actual decision-making that saved the Soviet Union was done by the Politburo and generals who weren't purged. Also, one of our generals has one extra soldier than they can effectively command. That's fine. Okay. One isn't gonna completely... I was gonna say, did you want to chuck him over to, like, to one of the army groups that has almost no one? It, no, because he has a larger border to defend by himself, so he needs all the help he can get. 
I just realized, what if Stalin, uh, what if Stalin died, and we're just like uh, puppeting, or we're just doing all of the work behind it and making sure that uh, everybody thinks he's still alive, he's, and like even like so, weekend at Bernie's, yeah, he is working, still alive. working at <laughs> work end, weekend at Yosef's. Here's the thing: he's already, he is not dead, but he did have a stroke to the point where he's completely incapacitated. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Planetarian And we Toad. still do, like, the Weekend at Bernie's, like, skit, where we're just, like... Planetarian... <laughs> we're just bringing his body along. Planetarian Toad has said on Meatball's stream, Panzerkampf is slowly starting to play in my mind. Well, nice. I'm Panzerkampf here, because we are... Toad. We are the Soviets. Hi, Toad. Uh, I'm also streaming. Meatball, do you know Toad? Toad? I feel like I've seen Planetarian Toad before. Yep. Yes. We, we have? Hi, buddy. Where? Where have we seen... my server. Oh. Yeah. Fun. Uh, I should say I'm, uh, both Yektan and Moshe are streaming as well. Oh, whoa. Oh, send in the tanks. Has the war started? Not yet. Yeah, just... Yep, Yek, stop scaring me. Stop scaring what? Moshe. They're sending the tanks to the front line. Yeah, they're, they're building up their front line now. <laughs> what? Thank you, thank you, thank you, Toad. Yeah, I, know that, I, know, I know that you were streaming, but I don't care. Don't thanks, care. thanks, Toad. Japan declared war on the Philippines. Dumbass. Wait, the Philippines is not in the Philippines are owned by the United States. What? Exactly. Hmm. Well, they're they're a quote unquote puppet of the United States. I gotta say, if they declared war on the Philippines in real life, America would have gone to war with them. Yeah. Because that's what happened in real life. America, what are you doing? Hopefully America acts. Also, they're attacking they didn't attack the Philippines until December 8th, 1941, so they're a couple months ahead of that. Japan is being smarter than they were originally. Hirohito got his shit together. It's not on December 7th, it's like August fucking first or something. It's August 7th. <laughs> shit. Okay. Also, oh, the United Kingdom has totally taken out uh, Italy's territories in Africa. Hmm. Based UK. Where? Jesus Christ! The Civil War in Norway is still going on. The Norwegian fascists are having a very hard time now. That's good, though. That's that's really good. They've Can been focus. Focus just cropped up for me. Uh, I'm probably going to jump down. Get some more forts if you wouldn't mind. I'll see if there's yeah. anything I can do for more forts. Impregnable forts? Yes. Pregnate forts. Yep, time to preg uh, make them impregnable. Yep. So we're essentially just shoving okay. in, uh, once an that, IUD in there. Yeah, once that's done, I'm gonna, I'd like to start going down the stuff that will help me with the allies. <clears throat> That's like Zanza's worst fear, uh, not able to pr impregnate forts. Lack of pregnancy. Yeah. Lack of pregnancy is pretty scary. <laughs> yeah, no, that is for sure. Okay. God, we have a lot of decisions that we could make. Philippines has capitulated. Uh, government into exile. Here he goes. That's... I feel... That's... Historically, that was not... The Philippines were not simply a protector to the United States. They were literally a whole-ass federal territory. Yeah, I don't think they did that. In this yeah. game, at least. Yeah, no, because in... No, but at the start of the game, they should be. The fact that they're mm -hmm. not is weird unless America made a decision that freed them. Otherwise, it could have just been an inaccuracy in the game for whatever reason. Because yeah. if Japan attacked the Philippines, America would have just gone to war with them. Oh, never mind. It says, after the trial of American and Filipino defenders. Wait, is America in the war with Japan now? Yeah. Uh, Are they? I'm very sure. Let oh. me see. Oh. Finish. Pause. No. Oh. oh, wait. Hang on a sec. This is funny because the original war against Finland did not happen. That's oh. sad. This is bad. Okay. Yeah. Um... Yeah, I was gonna say since they since we didn't do the original war with them, we haven't gained territory. Oh. Alright. 
right, tell me where to bomb. We have to reorganize some of our soldiers first. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh, yes, America is fighting Japan now. Yes. Okay. Oh, uh, should I do nighttime bombings? Hmm. Oh, Germany declared war on us too. Nice. Okay, so pause. I'm gonna go to the bathroom, and then we're gonna come back, and we're gonna handle this. Alrighty. <laughs> We love going to war, it's our favorite thing. fucking forgot about Finland. Whoops. Also, because in this game, so the original Russo-Finnish war was in 1939. We never did that. <laughs> we never we did We never did that. Maybe, they just decided maybe we to. Should, yeah. Maybe we should have, yeah. They, I guess they, they... We didn't even take any land from them, but they've decided now that they want it. Okay, I'm here. Uh, so the war is starting. Do we want to kick down the speed? Yeah, let's yes. do that. Also... Um, Meatball, tell me, so we should divide focus on which armies for the sake of, you know, not overwhelming any one of us. Um, does one of you want to take Finland? I'm trying to squeeze out as many troops as possible up there. Okay, uh, Yek, do you want to take Finland? Uh, I can cert most certainly try. Okay. Unless, if you want an easier job, you can take Hungary and Romania. Alright. If you'd rather do that. I can see what I can do against Finland. Um, uh, let's see, which uh, which army group would I have? You have... Uh, let me see here. Okay, these guys. Also, make sure we're, act make sure we're activating all the plans now. Make sure all the plans are activating. Um, if you're churning out forces, Meatball, before we unpause, let's talk before we unpause. Are um, where are you? If you're churning out soldiers, where are you dropping them right now? Um, so right now they're gonna be dropping in Tivkin. Where is that again? Southeast of Finland. Southeast of Tivkin. Fin Um, it's just northwest of an airbase. Yeah, there's a railway that passes through it. See Petrovskaya. Uh, it's east of northeast of Novgorod. Northeast. Southeast of, of Leningrad. Okay, so it's between the two of them. Uh, and further east. Oh, Tivkin. Okay, I see Tivkin. Yes. Okay. Gotcha. 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 Uh, also, before we start, we, we do, oh uh, we we don't have any oh we don't have anyone in Leningrad. No. I know. Okay, I'm probably going to send my... Whatever guys you give me there, I'm probably going to send right there. So you have control of... What is that? Army Group 5. Yes, and remind me... How do I... So I have Army Group Which 5. Will I Army get? Group 5... Who, oh god, it's all cavalry. Um, no, 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 no. Army Group 5 doesn't have any cavalry. Army Group 2 has cavalry. I see Army... Uh, uh, 25 and 13. Which, which numbers army am I in? You are in number 5. I I see... Where, where do I see 5? I see 1, 2... Over, over it. It's the third army group we have in. Okay, the third... Okay, so the one with army group... Okay, there we go. Yeah, okay, awesome. And you're sending... Okay, yeah, so we have guys coming from the eastern front. Oh my Japan's god. Japan's being chill with us. Okay, so they're coming there. How do I add soldiers to... Remind me how I add soldiers to an army group. I think you um, can merge them, yeah? Go ahead and, like, click and drag all of them. Okay. And then just go ahead and, uh... Like, like one of your armies. 
Okay, so I... Okay, so I just select the soldiers and then right-click on an army. Yes. Okay. Yep. Just so I know, oh. because I want to be able to, you know, make sure that when soldiers drop, I can add them in as quickly as possible. Also, uh... Yuck, do you want me to command the air guys near Finland? Or do you want to do that? Uh, air guys near Finland. Because you might... I don't know if you want to... Yeah, sure. You can you can take okay. priority on that. Yeah. Uh, you for my uh, bombers, yeah. where should I send the bombers to? You have bombers? I have two um, unassigned bombers that I can just run missions with. Um, I guess send them to Germany. Well, where in Germany? Warsaw? Sure. Okay. Yeah. Warsaw or Königsberg. How do I do that? You just send them to an area, and when they're in the area, you click on them, and it, you, there's different missions you can do. Also, I see we yep, have a I'm non aggression pack bombing. from Ethiopia. Sure, also, we have doctrine. Uh, we have naval doctrines and air doctrines available. Which one should we select? <sighs> oh my God! Okay. Disgusting. I'm really glad that we worked on our air power. Look at the the air tab, the strategic air map, and then look over. <laughs> look over the entire front. It's all green, except <laughs> yeah, that's good. Um, so I would say, yeah, so focus on sending, so the planes that are in Belarus, send them to Eastern Poland, because it's red there. Right. Like, One second. Yeah. We haven't even set up, uh, what is it? What? They haven't even really started doing the air superiority yet. Who hasn't? They haven't? Yes. Okay. 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 Now it's yellow. Oh, it's red again. Yeah, right. Okay. So, I... Uh, can someone make, someone make air wings available so I can send planes to Finland? Yeah. Fighter wings? Uh, okay. I'm going to... Uh, Mongolia wants to help in our efforts. Mongolia wants to join the war. Sure. sure. Okay, I'm, I, I, so I'm going to tab through these while I, someone can deal with the planes for right now. Belgium wants to sign non-aggression. South Africa wants non-aggression. Tanatuva is joining the war. Australia, New Zealand wants non-aggression. Netherlands wants non-aggression. British um, Malaya wants non-aggression. Yugoslavia wants non-aggression. The fall of... God damn it. Geez. We lost Leningrad. That's bad. Do we... I'm tabbing through this stuff. Can we either slow it down or pause? Yeah. Dutch East Indies wants Kingdom of Greece. British Raj. Oh, Canada wants to give us stuff. Okay. Yes. Anything, everything. Research slot is available. I yeah, I we are losing badly on the Finnish front. Uh, it's because there was nothing there. Yes, I know. I was expecting Finland to even attack us. I mean, that was probably a mistake on our part, because we should have expected they would have. Here's the thing, if we don't declare war and then we don't go down that path, they're not supposed to. Well. Yeah, it's... In fact, uh, after we declare war on them and stuff, they're not supposed to do anything with us. So, okay, so are there any... Yuck, do I have any planes to spare in the north? Uh... Let's see here. Uh, two. Uh, hmm. All these ones are going engaging on a bombing run. Superiority, by the way. Yeah. If, if there's any, if there's, you know what? I'm just gonna have you send at least send the planes. Please send anything to either Eastern Finland or East Karelia. Okay, I can send the bombers there, I suppose just anything fighters as well anything for close air support because we need to fucking capture that shit yeah yeah uh, yeah anything you can do for the um, should, I, uh, should i move one of my theaters to do close air support that's probably a good idea yes because okay. i have no armies right, I, yeah, these guys I, over there i have no armies over there 
Um, also, uh, yeah, make sure with some planes... Make sure also that, yeah, um, uh, Eastern, Western Poland, and currently, um, Eastern Balkans don't Into have air superiority. Yes. The German army marched, except for they didn't. Yes, uh, yeah, if there's any, anything that you can do on, I mean, anything you can do, if you see a territory that's red or yellow, make sure you're also dealing with that. Okay. At least the ones immediately close to us. Like, don't worry about Italy, that doesn't fucking matter. Mm -hmm. Wait, I see an... Why Why? Why do we have an airbase in... Oh no, that's that's the German one. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I sent the uh, I sent the Soviet Theater 1 over to do air superiority. So okay. We'll see how well that goes. Uh, we also have doctrines available. Do, do doctrines. Uh, which yes. ones? We can do uh, convoy sailing? Yes. Okay. Also, make sure, then, guys who are managing the armies, forces. make sure you do, um, uh, um, when we're going, make sure you click above your army groups, ac activate the plan uh, so they do their stuff. Should we go down the battlefield support uh, line for air doctrine? That's a useful one. Okay. All right. Uh, the other uh, the other air fleet should be supporting their respective armies. Okay. Awesome. Good. 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 The case? bombers. Uh, the bombers are going over to Warsaw to okay, do awesome. that's, bombing. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, um, Moshe, I what? got you your armies. I okay. gave them some airplanes. Awesome. I see that. Um, could somebody also um. Uh, are those those are mostly fighters, but hopefully they can do something. Um. Could we, uh, yeah, so above, I see that, like, plans for each of the armies. Do we want to activate the plans or no? Because currently nothing's activated. Um, um, let's, the thing is, we're holding Germany, so we don't really even need to do it at the moment. Anyway. Okay. I might, I might need to, I might need to activate my plan, Army Group, uh, Army Group Five. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna activate my plan just so everyone's what, forming what on the plan? defensive lines. There's, they're already doing that. Okay, but uh, but it says you need to click to execute. So there is no plans. Why does it say click to activate the execution of the plans? Because paradox. To draw yourself an offensive line. But you needed to execute the plan to also make sure they form along the front line. No, they will automatically do that. Okay, so right, okay. Just making sure we're clear, I'll take care of it from there. Okay. Alright. Are we good to pause? I guess we are. Come on. Okay, here we go. Most of them. And my guys, some people are coming in from the east. Expeditionary Force is sending 21 divisions to help us. Panatuv is sending 4 divisions to help us. Okay. South Africa oh. wants access, sure. Turkey wants non-agreement, sure. Non-aggression, sure. There you go. Okay. Uh, as you choose. Okay. okay, they are, they're pushing south. They're almost, they've almost taken Novgorod. Oh, the United States is joining the United Kingdom. That's something. Uh. Alrighty. Oh, shit. Okay, 
Uh, can I question. Okay. Yes. Should I create another army to put in my army group? If you want, yeah, I said uh, you can change the run as you choose. Okay. All armies that won't have to do the automatic remove in orders will be lost. What the? Uh, we might have a hole in Hungary soon. Probably should change. All of Hong Kong. Uh, I'm patching it up as best I can. Okay. Got up! Maybe I should start doing strategic bombing over there. Army. <laughs> what? Ooh. Okay. Look at the war. Look at the casualty rack so far. Yes. The Soviet Union has lost 37,000 men. The Germans have lost 1.76 million. Most of them are to the UK, but still. Okay, uh, hang on a second here. While we're here, I am going to... I need to break off some units to form another army real quickly. Okay. What is that? Yeah, I need, I'm doing math in my head. Give me a moment here. One, you doing two, I'm gonna go three, the four, Keep five, six. Mind. Yeah. Uh, are they commencing? Haven't uh, haven't gone there yet. I don't know. Here. Get off. Go. Okay. It Gotta really... love Finland. Also, good news, I already have an encirclement up in uh, uh, the Baltics. Training for the nice. guys in Tifkin is 16 out of 82%. So. The units that I have, that we are creating in Strelkovai, uh, in, in, in Tifkin, do we want to upgrade their equipment priority? Sure. Actually, there you go. Oh, do you just deploy them? Yes. Okay. Uh, they're, they're only 16% ready. That's, it's better than nothing. I guess so. Okay, give me a second here, and, okay, they're in. Okay, We've been added. Okay. Awesome. I'm. 
Right, we are very close. We're very close to losing an air group. Mm -hmm. uh, or close to losing an airfield. Um, so I see... Oh, there's guys in Karelia. Do we have any air forces over eastern Finland? Or over Novgorod? I'm... I'm trying. Well, there's one right, uh... Right in Finland. Uh, no, no, no. So, 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 no, no, so, re remember, no, no, no. Look, look. Look at the strategic air map. You see... You see that East Karelia is green? Yeah. Look at Eastern Finland next to it. There's nothing over Eastern Finland. Okay, I'll just move it over East, there then. Eastern Finland, also some over Novgorod might be good at some point because they're pushing into Novgorod. Okay. But yeah, just like, because remember, all of that is areas where we're fighting, so... East Finland and Novgorod will be next priorities. Honestly, this might not be okay. the first thing because the biggest thing the Finns usually have is defending on core territory, so if they leave their core territory, they're going to be way fucking weaker. <laughs> yeah, I and know, but they're... Because they're... they'll be far from home, you can cut them off and just destroy their units entirely. That's 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 the goal. Okay, I'm I'm ready when you guys are. I'm good to go. Uh, yeah. Ready yeah. whenever you are. Yeah, I'm gonna right. I, I'm gonna wait till I till we um uh, um build up more forces and then I'll start going on the offensive. But I gotta get my guys in quickly. Hey. Why aren't you guys moving to the front lines? Who? The new soldiers that I put down are not moving to the front lines. Hmm. Which ones? The 12 that I just assigned to Army 10. There you go. No, tell me how. Don't just... Go ahead and when you, like, go ahead and click and drag over them. On the bottom right... Like on the on the uh, divisions assignment mode, yes. go ahead. The what is that? Fourth one from the right. Fourth one from the right. It should be like a dude Division. with a line. Okay. A dude with a line. With the line the plus. plus sign. Yes. Plus yeah, sign. yeah, yeah. No, again, just as, and it, then go it, ahead and click on the um, that is the cool. solid line. Okay. Awesome. Good. 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 Okay. Yeah. So that's fine. Just I'm gonna make sure um in the future um. If I ask something like that, don't just immediately do it for me. Just make sure I know how to do it. Yep. So that I can figure it out. Or so that I can know. Are my planes actually going to where they told them to do? Okay. Soldiers are moving in. That's good. Start being able to hold them off, hopefully. Okay. Okay. There we go. Air wings with no mission assigned. That's uh, what? Do, do we want to start moving the guy? Yeah, so there's unassigned in uh, a bunch of places. Do we actually want to move the guys in... Wait, are we... What's going on in the Eastern Theater? I have no idea. Are we at war with Japan yet? No. Yeah, we're not at war with Japan. It says there's guys assigned to Vladivostok. Do we want to keep those planes there? Do we want to start sending them over? No, start sending them over. Okay. You do that. Right, so actually, quick. I'll just start putting them in. Uh... Yeah, just yeah, just just because. So the main area that you are looking at at the army right now, Hungary and Legionary Romania, that's easy. Those guys you can mostly steamroll over, and you've already made some territorial gains. So no. Yeah. Yeah. So. Any assistance you can do with the plans. That's good. I'm sending the bombers over to the Northern Balkans to do some strategic bombing. Starting to get overrun. 
I'm seeing a... No. Okay. Okay, guys are starting to arrive from the eastern front. I'm glad I upgraded those fucking railroads. Yeah. This is gonna be hard and or bad, but we're gonna... We're gonna do what we can. It's gonna hold them off for a little bit. Once I have all my forces there, I'll start making a push. You think XCOM, XCOM 2 crash? Impossible. Illegal. Uh, Planetary and Toad says, It seems like one of the more recent updates, Finland will now seek German protection from Russia, which causes them to join the attack. Yeah. Mm. In, in, the forts can no longer become pregnant. Okay, I am going yep. to... Do you want me to move industry to the Urals, or does that not really matter right now? Because we're doing yes. this. You want me to move them? Actually, you don't... Nah, yeah, yet. Okay, I am going to... Uh... There's a whole bunch of things I can do. I'm going to uh, modify our defense industry. There we go. Non-aggression pack from the Philippines. Sure. Officer Corps can be modified. We are doing... We are doing way better than the Soviets did at the start of the war, that is for sure. <laughs> You're goddamn right. And good news is it's going to be winter soon. Women oh, are... no. Winter is coming. Winter is coming! Uh, why aren't my bombers going to bomb? Do they have the range? They should, yeah. The People's Avengers... Turkey has cancelled the Lend-Lease, whatever. Oh. Uh. Okay, gonna wait a little bit for my guys. And then, okay, more people are crawling in. Crawling in my crawl. Crawling in my skin. It's kind of good. Cipher for Japan is fully decrypted. Also, let me know if you want me to do any encryption shit. Spy shit. Do you want me to... Okay, I can't decrypt Germany yet. Do you want me to decrypt Japan? Sure. Okay. Yeah. Reveal intel. I mean, we're not doing anything against Japan. Okay. No, That's yeah, why no. we should. Yeah, not yet. Okay, okay. Just think, unless we're actively fighting. Okay, are there any operations that you would like me to do? Um, Infil can you. Can I infiltrate? So I can infiltrate the German civilian administration, I can infiltrate the army, I can infiltrate the navy, I can infiltrate the air force, I can make resistance contacts, or I can prepare the collaboration government. Do, do the collaboration government. Keep doing those until you can. Okay, okay, I was saying earlier I couldn't. But. That's fine. We'll keep going. And we'll prepare that, and I'm going to upgrade that. Okay. Okay. It, okay yeah, my guys are making, so my soldiers are making their approach. It's getting slowly better. Yes. So I think the Finns are probably... Once they all show up, I'll make a push on Finland. I'll start. Okay, they. Canada's canceled yeah, the land lease. That's Antioch. fine. <gasps> Australia is giving us equipment. Hey, okay, that's what I like. I like to see. Yep. Actually, Mo Moshe, what you should do is attack there and cut their forces in half. Right now. And then go ahead. Um, I mean, once you think you're good, and you can also move these guys all the way in the west. Well, I mean, I was just, I was, um, I was just gonna draw an offensive line kind of there, so you know. Over. Well, yeah. I mean, if you do that, that's not gonna cut them off. Actually, this is actually potentially even better. This guy can go up. Okay, just I, this can, way. Just, can I take care of it? Yes. Okay. You, you, you're saying to do in a, a general offensive line, which is not the optimized strategy. So. Nothing I do is the optimized strategy. What's the point of me playing? Uh, what is... Got half tracks. Okay, there's the BTR. That's very good. 
Uh, okay, got a couple more guys we're waiting on. But, mm, looks like most of them are there. There's some guys that Let's are still struggling. Let's fucking go. Spots. I'm just adjusting my, uh... Okay, they are... Audio right now? Okay, there we go. Should be good. They... Uh... They are attacking us, and... Okay, that's not good. I'm gonna hold. Continue holding for now. It's never good. Oh, no, no, that's the, um, fucking, uh, Tanatuva's sending an attack force against, uh... against, uh, a Finnish division. Okay. Okay. We are now bombing uh, the Northern Balkans. Thank you. We are bomb Bing. Okay. Oh, the Belarusians, uh, the Belarus bases in short supply. Gato. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, we're really in the shit of it, huh? That's kind of how war goes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, look at the casualties again. We have caused Germany over... It's coming up on 700,000 casualties. So, again, we, are we doing... haven't even accrued 200. We are doing very well relatively... relative. Again, compared to how the Soviets did at the start of the war, we have our shit together. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Although the Finland Here's front the isn't oh, looking no. too good. I mean, it's not. It's, it's held. It's looking better, though. It has held. It's and held. we have now encircled part of their territory. That We actually forced them out of ways. It's good. That little bubble area there. I'm gonna. I, I'm just gonna quickly wipe that with uh, one of my guys just so we have it full. Oh, good. I got you. Okay. Uh, where is. Okay, yeah, any uh, any extra air you can send to Novgorod will be good right now because I'm making a pushback for St. Petersburg. Oh crap, they're sending in guys like crazy. You could also decrypt uh, Finland. That's probably a good idea. I'll I'll do that. Cryptology. Hungar Hungary proclaims Greater Hungary F. They follow themselves, huh? Hmm. Yep. Hungarians are just hungry for being stupid. Is Hungary real? Maybe. Yeah, the Finns are redeploying their forces in some spots. I'm prob- so yeah, they're redeploying to defend St. Petersburg. They see what I'm going for. Um, I may start pushing forces to go get Murmansk then. Well, hopefully there's more something. Yeah. Yeah, they're they're smart. They moved a lot of their forces to defend St. Petersburg. Yeah, it, getting Bramansk back is important because that's an important port to the north. Right. Come on, take that funking Termitormi. Try to be careful with my movements here because I'm doing better now, but I'm still a little bit overstretched. <laughs> okay. 
Верно. Goop my boys a little bit. May. That's good. Готов. Think. Can I deploy the next uh, batch of my guys that I'm, uh, um, uh, the next batch of guys in Tifkin? Um, yeah, give me, give me one second. I'm going to go ahead and add. Just because it looks like they're going to try to I'm going to conduct it. a, I'm going to conduct a trade deal to, yeah. Go ahead, do it. Go ahead, do it. Okay. Uh, deploy. Okay, and... Sending bombers over your way, too. We're buying okay. Turkish guns. So that's one, two... That's six my, plus my seven. Two. Seven. Okay, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Unassign, okay, create an army, drag the army to the army group, get a general, Philip, there we go. Okay. They are, uh... Oh my god, they're already on service by requirement. We're still on volunteer only. Oh. We have. Uh, I'm. I'm listing low manpower. Yeah. Guess what? We're only recruiting 1.5 percent of our entire population right now. The next bump up is 2.5. The next one after that is 5 percent. The next one after that, which they're at right now, is 10 percent. Jesus. Okay, we're weathering they have, the storm. We are. They're recruiting almost 10 times. <laughs> the amount of percentage of their population is real right now. Do you think we should start more mobilization? Again, just keep keep pulling them down. Once we start to turn the tide a bit, then we can start pushing in with that. Okay. It's not a good idea. It's, it's not a bad idea to begin looking at it though now. Mm -hmm. But we can't commit to that yet. We have caused them 1.1 million casualties by ourselves. Yeah. Unassigned air divisions? Yep, give me one second. You get one. We've lost 1.6 thousand men to Italy. Disgusting. How? I don't know. Lend lease from India. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh, Moshe, can I point something out real quick? Yes. That's entirely open. Okay. I'm just gonna dealing with the fucking. I'm trying to deal with. There were guys pushing in the south, so I was dealing with that. I see the openness. I'm going for that next. Just give me a sec. I'm, I'm not telling you to do it. I'm just pointing it out. Yes, I know. It's already been observed. Okay. Yeah. Okay, they've pushed there, that's good, and... Okay. I'll just send some... Go! Okay. Moving in. Yeah, they've moved more of their guys south, which is good. Uh, 
They're making moves Why there. Aren't they flying? military factory time and you start queuing them up. Alright, you got it, boss. So try to try to put them not closer to the yeah, front than gotcha. Moscow, but... Honestly, you can, if you can plop them in, like, Kazakhstan... Or... Center or so, south and south. Fine, I'm pushed again, and they're not doing well. Good. Okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. Got extra armament is good. Uh, I'll just start uh, dispersing. The... Okay, so another question: Do I? Uh, what? Do, do I re do I restore Cossack units, which boosts our cavalry, or do I get um, cohesion first, which improves our organization but increases training time? Um, get the cohesion for it, because as much as the cavalry thing is nice, it's just really not going to be much of a priority. Okay. Boost your overall um, troops what? Um, supply. What? If it, I switched it to full motorization priority. Okay, that's good. Okay. Also, you still have a bunch of troops still, still trailing. Yes, I know. Make but, uh... sure that they're on the continuity deployment, because then they'll take the, like, the trains and shit. I mean, they're, it looks like they're doing it now because they're following nope. the train lines. Making them walk. Oh, we're making them walk all the way there. Wait, how do I how do I put them in strategic deployment? Um. So if you look, like you click on the army. Yes. Right. You'll see like whatever the general and whatnot. Yes. You know, they said there's such a one selected just to the right. of will see railroad tracks. Click there. Okay, wish I knew that earlier. I could have gotten my guys there faster because it's a matter of days on the Trans-Siberian Railway. Could have made a lot of progress already, whatever. They're coming. Okay, this will be better. Okay. We've killed 1.5 million Germans. Those are rookie numbers. We gotta pump those numbers up. So a question because I, so I'm not familiar with the larger army group thing. If I make a defense, if I make an, is the front line for the whole army group and all army groups are interspersed evenly, or are army groups look okay? If I do an offensive line, should I do it for the whole army group or for a specific army? I'm sorry. Could you restate that? If my brain just fired. If I want to make an offensive line, should I do that for the whole army group or for a specific army? 
With the type of army you're commanding, which is mostly infantry, you can usually just do it for the entire army. Okay. Hmm. In which case, once they're here, I'm going to make a push. I'm going to make a, a cup. So, I you can also set up multiple offensive lines, right? Yeah. Um, okay, just because I'm trying to decide it on... Confuse those sometimes. Okay. So just okay, do, do, just because there's kind of two main offensive arcs I need to take. I is would say... If, if I were you, the first thing I would do is just try to cut off as many of them as possible. I mean, I, I, I'm do I'm working on that just, on an oh, individual. You guys are about to get cut off. You guys are about to get cut off. Where? Right there. If you bring those guys down there, and you bring someone else up to defend them, actually, you can bring one of them to we're, just attack. We're, we're working them on it. People are being there. Yeah, bring one of them to just attack them right away. Yeah, so we can okay stop that from happening. Okay. Well, don't don't attack him now. Let him go back, and then take that territory so he's encircled. Yep, we got more planes. Yep. Just splitting up some of the air uh, air force so that we can uh, divide and conquer. All good. We are now on limited conscription. Guys, it's 1942, and now we're going to start recruiting people. Royce. Now. Now is the time. Yeah, just Not too far. We the, still um, don't need it, when, but I still like a more buffer. When you drew the front lines for my guys, did you do it individually for the armies or for the whole thing? It's for the whole thing. Okay, because I, I see that there's some units in places that aren't on the front line, but they're, like, behind. Why is that the case? One second. Like, there's- I see a guy in Tifkin, or Tikvin, yeah. and that doesn't border anything, but he's in an army group. Um, that's because... Um, sometimes it just bugs out like that. You, you might have to, again, go ahead and click on him, do the whole divisions assignment mode, and just click him back on the, um, the solid line. The entire army group. Okay, hang on a it's a bit annoying, but... Okay, I'm gonna do that. Let's go, he's back in. Oh no, no, it assigned him to a different army group when I did that. Rather, it assigned him to an army that he wasn't in. Okay, so it, it you must have clicked on the, uh, what is it, the uh, line with the different fucking, what the hell is it, levels of, like it's, I don't know how to describe that. It's got like the lines in it, the, the solid one. I clicked division assignment mode. Okay, but it also depends on which thing you click on. It has to be the solid line. Okay. Royce! Okay. Here. The solid line, not the dash. Or sorry, not the I'm not the not the pronged line. Correct. Didn't do anything different. Not the prong line. Didn't do anything different. Uh, well, now, because he's already been assigned to a different division. How do I move him back, then? Just go ahead and click on him, and then right-click on whichever original one he was in. Okay. Go, uh... Oh, yeah, that's right. We, uh... Should we use our navy for something? Oh, wait, we um, already have it on the Gulf of Finland. It's just fucking perpetually repairing, I swear. <laughs> I'm, I'm serious. Since the beginning of the game, I've been trying to make it do stuff, and it's like, you want to stop the repair order? What do you? What have you been repairing this whole time? All right. Focus. Well, I mean, considering the fact that they're Russian, uh, I know, it might be a lot. Probably still re repairing for the Russo-Japanese War. <laughs> 
fucking Probably. 30 years earlier. It's like the guys that were repairing it, like the kids are now repairing it. And uh, we also have no divisions in basic training. That's fine. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay, we sunk uh, two, uh, two ships in Helsinki. That's good. Okay, time for new rifles. Ooh, SKS. SKS, SKS. Ooh, SKS. Really early. Damn. Yep. Damn indeed. I love the SKS. Yes, I know you have. I can you imagine do. why, yeah. No, I can't imagine why. Please explain. Okay. Most of my guys have arrived. I think I'm going to start an offensive line. Everybody's still on service by requirement. That's fine. I'm not expecting that to change soon. But we're still holding very well so far. They're not even pushing in Romania. Romania is not even trying to fucking poke that bear. Gato! This is smart. We got three planes, Jack. Yep. Gato! Royce! Gato! Gato! Hey. While I'm getting ready to launch my attack and see how the others are doing, holding their own in one, mostly holding their own. Yeah, unfortunately, it looks like the uh, our boys to the south, the enemy is reinforced a lot. Hmm. A little bit of a stalemate, but it's a stalemate in our favor. I'm gonna check my spy shit real quick. Operations, air collaboration, government is still in progress. That. Second of the convoy. Base. Ah, oh, they have tanks and they're moving them. Yeah. Should get some uh, should get some military factories very soon. Okay, let me see here. How we doing? God, my guys are going through it with uh. So if I click on a unit, I see a green line and an orange line. Remind me which means which. Uh, wait, wait. You see what? You click on a unit. Yes. You mouse over a unit, their basic insignia, there's a green bar and an orange bar. What's the green bar and what's the orange bar? Oh. The green bar is the organization, and the other one is their health, basically, their strength. Okay. If you hover over it, it will say it for you. I, I, I did, it wasn't very clear. That's fair. Okay. You uh, have those guys that are completely encircled, by the way. You can cut them off and completely destroy those units. Where... I mean, I I see at least some encirclement. Yeah. Okay, so should I just push? Should I just push my guys in now? Yeah, focus them if you can. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting. I'm getting. Uh, I'm getting no contests in like Romania right now. Anything that you can do. I'm adding to more so you can focus forces there a little better. Unfortunately, when I attack, here's the thing: attacking those guys is not terrible. Simply, oh, you get this guy. Yeah, they're my, my. I'm losing on a lot of those fronts. 
here's the thing, they can't recover um supplies. Yeah, you know, like like I'm sending I'm sending some guys against and they just instantly stop attack. They're probably really low org. Yeah, they're actually that guy's actually really high org. What the hell? Most of them are really low though. We have officer core roles. I don't know exactly how to do with that. Got it. Um... Another attack. Yeah, sure, Belgium. Go wild. Dare you. Oh, yes! Okay. Encirclement continues. That is good. I got guys moving into the north. Yeah, I gotta be careful what I'm doing right now because they have really strong defenses south right. of St. Petersburg. I am bombing Finland right I pro now. I, prob boys. I probably can't push that yet. Here's the thing, if you keep doing what you're doing with this one little bubble there, keep pulling him in, cutting him off, yeah. and then cutting him off, you'll be just evaporating their manpower. Got up. What do what? I yeah, see I something them. that says yeah, two divisions, Eastern Finland strategic offense operation. Nice. Okay, why does it say what? two divisions? What the? Look at the front line near the encirclement. I see something red that says two divisions. What is that? I don't know. To be honest. Um. Yep. Back to tanks. And squirkle their tanks. I'm in squirkling. Alright, yeah, I know oh, that. Let's see, you only have two of the guys in that um, army. Divi division half. That that uh, army, yeah, assigned to that part of the line. Oh, 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 so they can, so they can be assigned to, okay. Yeah, the guys in army 12, your third guy, the bald dude. Yes. Or the second bald dude. Yes. Um, can be assigned to the red part of the line there. Only the red part? Only the red part. Okay. I, okay. I, yeah, I just... Honestly, if I was setting this up, I probably just would have done individual front lines, because this is annoying. But when it... when Here's the thing. When a land border like this is partially cut off, the whole thing gets weird. That's not you. Also, you can push with a lot I'm more guys. I'm trying to figure this out. This is very difficult for me. This is very confusing played this game before, but I've never had an army set up like this, so I'm just very lost right now. The armies do get a bit quirky at night. Oh, I, I've never had this hard of a time dealing with armies before. I don't know what is going on, but whatever. Nice. Just casually bombing their buildings, as usual. Good. Fucking. Actually, I could move them over to this part. Yeah, Honestly, you might want to just micro those guys. I'm, 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 I, that's what I'm doing now because of the way it's organized. 
I have to micro them. Royce. There you go. Next time I'm doing this, I'm doing individual front lines for the armies. Beep -beep, uh, indeed. Apparently, XCOM crashed again. Unsurprising, that's what XCOM does. Gexcom. Gex you can entirely cut off all the guys in Leningrad. Right. I just have to micro everything, it's really fucking annoying. Should also have done uh, intelligent, or we should have done a spy agency on, f <laughs> on Finland as well. Well, we're doing it now. Yeah. No, hindsight's always twenty twenty. Uh, Malisha, you have a gap in their line. You might want to try to exploit that if you can. Hey, like Roman is the whole thing right now. I know. See many gaps. Many bats. Five seconds away from deleting this front line and just reforming it completely. Stalin would be proud of us, gentlemen. Actually, would he's still alive? Probably. He says he's proud of me, but then he said he's fucked my mother. Mm. In the same sentence? Like, yes, separate one comma. Oh, there we go. Okay, I should. I'm making some of my guys do a push for Mermonts. Once they take Mermonts, I'm gonna reorganize this line. Should also be helping with the bombing efforts as well. Why is every unit, even ones that I already clicked strategic redeployment order is on, it auto shifts to off? I do not it's know. Just, uh... So annoying. Okay, we have the encirclement. It, it was encirclement. But I, yeah, you know what I mean. I mean that we finally got around that gap with the um, uh, um with the sea. So now they're fully encircled on land, on all sides. Land, sea, and circle. Good job, men. Royce? Is there a way I can... Um, I'm, I'm trying to help, and I'm trying not to come off as a dick like a know-it-all. But, like, I'm trying to help describe it. If you push in from each side to a centralized point, think of it like the mass stays the same in a smaller space so it becomes more pressurized. If you try to slice bits off of it at a time, then there will be less... It will be more diluted as it gets smaller. I understand that, and I've been trying to do that. I did that earlier here, every unit was doing that, and then some of them won it, 
See, there, some of, the, some there of them were, are running it right now, were, and some of them aren't. There were a few spots there where you, a few more could have been done. Awesome. It's because I'm microwing and I'm missing stuff. Nice. Lemon. Lemon. Do you want to have prison units to help you in Finland? I don't really. Need, <laughs> I don't need that right now. I have other stuff I might want to prioritize. Uh, so should we go for brilliant genius or great commander? I'm jumping back to military stuff first. Yeah, I know. I I have uh, I have the focus tree right now. I got your back. Or maybe no, we can't do that. We'll here yet. Yep. Can't do that. No, can't do that either. Uh, come on, come on, boys. What? Yeah. Once this rehabilitated. Is, <laughs> once I have this fucking shit dealt with, I'll do it. I'll need to ask for a pause so I can reorganize briefly. <laughs> yeah, dang, Moshe's Moshe's bringing it in. It was, just, it was just a matter of numbers, and I'm, I would have done it faster, but this the way this is organized right now, I am very Don't much worry, just struggling hopefully to handle. My, hopefully my bombing will help you. Your bombing is helping. I've seen it help. Yeah, no, we're, we're just in Japan. Mm -mm. Haven't done that yet. Oh god, yeah. Would you? It's you're you're doing it right now. Oh. Have fun. I don't know why that was happening. I thought it was. I thought I'd selected the German one. Eh, whatever. No, oh, no, one of my planes got shot down. <laughs> the one, the one of the Finnish just started shooting rifles at it, and eventually they got it. Probably, it was uh, what's his name, the fucking sniper. <laughs> Royce? Yeah. We're not. Fucking knocked a. We're <laughs> the pilot out of a. Russian plane out of the sky from fucking 500 like, miles away without a scope. Very lucky shot. Bam. Sweep through there. Just do a sweep. Yep. Just do a fucking sweep. Come on, guys. Naval Department intel Royce. done. Plus 20%. Mexico wants to give us tanks and aircraft. That's hilarious. Great. Alright, where's the aircraft? Okay. No, I bet the uh, I bet the tanks like have like uh hydraulics, so they just like jump up and down. Oh god. <laughs> Yes. Give me a second, I have to open up my fucking window. It's like 7 billion degrees in here again. That's a lot of degrees. That's a lot of nuts! Okay. Everyone here. Finishing the last the encirclement there. I'm gonna do a... I'm gonna ask for a pause so I can do some redeployment once that's done. Yeah, war in Finland's actually going pretty well now. It's it's more or less wrapped up. Yeah. Hard. The the hardest part is okay. SKS is made. Yes, may it is. may SKS I is. may I request ein pause now? Uh, yeah, go ahead. I'll actually, start using this to disperse more of the. Uh... Okay. 
Gâteau. We'll focus more on military buildings. In the meantime, here. There you go, baby. You want fries with that? I think Eastern Finland doesn't really have a lot of stuff here. Does it? Yeah, I think some of the more sweeter targets are over there, so. Sweeter. <laughs> well, I mean, they're Finnish, not Swedish, so. Fish. Fish. Swedish fish. Bash. Finnish fish. There you go. Finnish fish. Fetus swish. Fetus swish. What's up? I'm trying to... I'm trying to draw individual front lines for the army so I can have them organized in a way I can manage. And it's not letting me do the usual draw the line, it's just auto-snapping to the whole thing. Oh, so you gotta... I think it's like... left-click and drag, or right-click and drag? Okay. Okay, it's right okay no, there we go, yes. Right okay, there we go. Is that... You going to front line. I might need to create a few more air wings. We're losing yeah. planes fast. The good thing is, this, uh, these military factories is actually perfect timing that they're coming in. Yippee! I mean, earlier the better, but you know what I mean? We can't really, couldn't really afford it that super early. Yeah. Actually, very nice spread on the, uh, what is it, factory tech. Thank you. I mean, building the, uh, what is it, military factories in, like, fucking Siberia, no one's gonna even get there. They wouldn't even expect Siberia. Honestly, it's just a, a bunch of people in a hut just fucking building guns. <laughs> Could you imagine? Like a wood stove keeping them warm. Okay. Here. Nope. Ooh. Eastern Balkans, we might actually be able to do a push. What do you think, lads? Um... No. Oh no, over there. Uh oh wait, no, yeah, for the um these guys they should be able to. Actually what I might do in a bit here, you might reorganize this yet, so you'll have your yeah. own individual army group entirely. Yes. Mm-hmm. Well, just let me. I don't want to assign them. I just want to move them to attack a specific point. Jesus Christ. Okay. Trying to have my seven unit army 
move to deal with that encircle that last tiny encirclement? Uh, the one you have here? Yes. How do I move okay. them there? Because I'm, I'm, Is clicking, the, the... I'm clicking them and all I it has the paintbrush tool for me. And I'm trying to okay. not do that. What, for the front one? It does, yes, and I'm trying to stop that. You don't you don't want to... I'm just click front line again. Okay. And then just right click on it, dude. Okay. Right dick. Okay. There we go, okay. I should be good. Unpausing. Unpogging? Yes. Hell yeah. Uh, Moj, you should, uh, see if you can potentially sweep those guys, um, north of Leningrad, south to cut them off. You uh, have no fury. Fury, you tell this. Why does it... it always clicks <laughs> off... Why does strategic deployment instantly turn off after I click it? I, mm. I don't know exactly. Like, I click it, and then I tab away, and then it stops. I know. Um, yeah, you have more planes. Yep. Toad says, <laughs> building artillery shells in yak skin huts. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so where, what did he say? Building artillery shells in yak skin huts. <laughs> uh, why are they not doing anything? Why is this not... There we go. I can't I can't do any missions with this thing. Go. Okay. Moving there now, that's good. Yeah, got off. Okay. Mirna. Bad news is Germany's more or less stabled off on casualties. Yeah. And they're not, mm. they're not pushing anymore. But at this point, it's really just a stalemate. At the least, yep. in a stalemate, in a good way, because we have the United States on our side. Yippee. Okay. I'm pushing my offensive lines in the north. In the in a second, I'm gonna move the next start moving the next lines up. Why are you guys walking? I don't want you to walk. Like I click it and then they forget. There you go. And I click away comes back and it is backed off again. That's so weird. Oh, they're coming now, that's good. Last of our
Uh, you have a bunch of uh, uh, dudes tied up in the Kola Peninsula or anything. Huh. Kola Peninsula, they're, they're, they're moving to... They should be moving to take it. I have the... Um, they're not moving at all. Well, I have the offensive. No, I have the offensive line there. Just give me a second here. Well, some of the reorganization led to some stuff, but that's fine. Easy fix. For some reason, these air wings are gay. Yeah, really? Are dumb and poopy? Yes. Yes. They're stinking sloopy. Continuing to rehabilitate the military. Okay. Yeah, I got Go. That. Push it. Push it real good. Yeah, these planes can't do anything. Okay. And... okay offensive line time. Oh, this line's going to be so offensive. Push there and boom. Go. Okay. Next big push is happening. Yep, they're moving. That's good. We've done a big cutoff here. All of you guys now. Fuck this guy in the pussy. Gentlemen, let's take our shit back. Gonna do okay now that this is here. I can do a little bit more micro. Because um, we are now getting Katusha launchers. <laughs> also, I would say I can play maximum one more hour. It is 1 a.m. right now. If we want to end before then, that is fine. You know, just uh. Hey. I don't know. Can you guys be straight before then? A mm. little bit. No. The answer for much is no. Yeah. Yep, my boys are pushing. Okay, that's good. Yeah, those guys have stopped for dumb reasons. That's fine. I can... No, you go there. You go there. You... No. Go Slavia. Smirna! There we go. Okay, that'll wrap that up. God, the Luftwaffe. There's just so many fucking Luftwaffe. It's ridiculous. The Luftwaffe? Yeah. I'm t uh, I essentially just moved all of our planes to the Polish side, but Jesus. I wonder if I switch it to nighttime operations. Would that work? I, help. I am building radar stations there. Oh, oh the okay. France during the access. U.S. is Why declaring has that war. Not happened already. Yes, it has. Okay, and ooh, collab government's been yes. done, and it has been a success. No, wait, what? Guys, look at Ethiopia. What? It huh? exists. Yeah, exists. Huh. That's uh, ain't that something? The bad news is though that Vichy France has actually taken a lot of Africa back from the uh, British. Yeah. Mm. Germans are pushing again. That's good. Hey. Okay. They're getting desperate. Hey, I am about to start my next phase of my assault. Go, Moshe. We're just gonna... Ireland is joining the Allies. Interesting. Okay, yeah. and boom. Well, because Ireland was neutral in World War II, so that's interesting for sure. Um, okay, we are I beginning our a... push. Moshe, I have a question. Yes. I don't have much to do right now. Do you want me to do something in the Spymaster stuff? Uh... If there's anything you immediately see right now, sure, I'm mopping up the last of, uh, you know. Yeah. 
Okay. You guys get back to the front. Okay, excellent. Okay, just yes. I just, those. yeah, I needed... I should have done that finish reorganization earlier. I'm having an easier time now. Just managing the troops. Okay, uh, there we go, boys. And our seventh are going to also push... Ooh, close those guys in at a beeper, beeper, yeah, what the hell it is. Beeper, beeper. At where? At there. So when these guys come north? Yes, no, 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 I, I, I see that there. The offensive line is for there. I, I know, but... Like just micro. There you go. I'm just saying. I'm I'm trying to help you out. The not, way when they when not, they eventually do successfully get pushed out, you don't want them to still be around. Okay. Good news. The nighttime uh, nighttime offensives are actually helping us out a bit. Yeah, night night bombings were great, and the Russians did well with them. We're not Yuri. We're going to do night bombs. We're not. Let's see if this does anything. Hmm. Good amount of green across the board, but not enough. Let's see here. Get up. Uh, Honestly, this time might not be a bad idea. Okay, there we go, and... Oh, we don't lose entrenchment by doing that. Ooh. Military is rehabilitated, that's good. Okay, gonna shift over back to international stuff and work towards shit with the allies. God, and like nobody's in, uh, or very few people are pushing while like all the planes are just shooting the fuck. It's like instead of the Battle of Britain, it's the Battle of fucking. Eastern Poland. Come on, guys. Fucking use your goddamn. Oh, right. I forgot. Right, I'm station fucking station at station war with station Norway, station. too. Okay, I'm gonna have to sweep through their territory next. Sweep! Okay. Awesome. Um, we have. We're very close to retaking St. Petersburg. You guys have stopped. Closing that gap. Yes, I it's about to get pushed. I, I was just moused over it. Please, man. I, I'm gonna act to actually ask you to stop. Okay. Because I was literally mousing over it to move them right as you told me. Like I'm doing what I can here. It's okay. It's okay. Понимаю укрытие. Are we doing over there? Very good. Very good. That's what I like to see, men. Lend lease from the Raj. More hawkers. Hell yeah. That's very good. No complaints there. Royce. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, insufficient resources. Oh. We're not. <coughs> no, we're running low on rubber. America canceled their lend oh, lease. There you go. Nice. We're not. Oh shit. Okay, Hungary is now starting to attack. Lovely. Uh That's a good tasty pushes. Tasty tasty. Scrumptious even. Hey, boys. Go in for the cutoff. Go in for the cutoff. Uh, yep. Leningrad has been retaken. 
Are we winning, Soviets? Yes, we are. Uh, yep. Uh, oh, Romania is attacking right now. Hold on, I just need to get shit. Whoa, mania. Oh, whoa. I might actually need to send the bomber planes over there. Okay. Give me one second. Uh, 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 you're gonna be off of the forts very soon. That's bad. Yeah, I know. Some help would be nice. Forms. Okay. Yeah, I say if we you want to, if, if, uh... if, if you want to drop, if you want to drop the next batch of units that are being shipped over there. Yes, please. That might be the thing to do. Sure. Because I'm absolutely fine here. Just yeah, y Yek needs more units next. Yeah, so I'll be taking uh, these guys. Okay. And then here. So what do I do? Do I just uh, wait? What? Select the units. Right click on the army you want them to join. Okay. Remember that if you want to be really optimal, make sure that the number of units you have is not over the command ability. You can create new generals if you need to for that. <laughs> and then assign them accordingly. Oh. oh, okay. Boish! I have never been so proud to be Soviet. That's the wrong accent. Oh, whoops, accent. Ah, oh, fuck, that's the wrong accent. Yeah. Uh, hold on. So... We are sleeping. I accidentally, I accidentally got your, uh, your troops. I'm sending them back, though. Uh, hmm. Yank tank. Yank tank. Okay, I might need some. I might need some tanks over here. Okay. Well, let's let's just go at it slowly. Okay. The only thing I've left to max out, I guess. We're gonna have a perfect spy agency. Okay, boys. Here yeah, I'm we definitely go. gonna need some more reinforcements over Jesus here. Jesus Christ, outrunning. This is a certified outrunning my supply lines moment. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's fine, whatever. Okay, we're getting some redeployment. There we go. Yes! Okay. The bulk of their army has been utterly crushed. Nice. Secure Leningrad. Here we go. Okay. Uh, I am going to redeploy one... I have one unit of 24 guys under my overall command. Where would you like me to put them? I'm still operating with them, uh, um, Army Group Five overall. But one of my yeah. one of my armies are good. Would you like me to send them somewhere? Yeah, please. Where? Tell uh, me. Over to over to the uh, Romanian border. Okay. I see a little gap in the front line just north of the Romanian border. Yeah, please do that. Well, but that's a single gap, and it's German. It's not Romanian, so someone would have to stretch a unit there. The Germans are pushing through that gap, actually. Yeah. Uh, we can actually probably do that to... Um... I'm going to... Oh, yeah, the... Oh, yeah, the, 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 they're they're pushing in behind you. Okay, I'm yeah, going... Yeah, I know. Okay, I'm moving my... I'm moving my whole fucking army down there right now. Thank you. Yeah, I'm moving army 11 down because... I'm gonna... I'm gonna not gonna need most of the soldiers up here very shortly. It's just a matter of yeah. conquering the rest of Finland. Uh, and, uh, starting to make a push into Norway. So make sure you're dedicating air forces now to, um, uh, I am. territories. I am. We are, yeah, it's, it's, it's looking red right now in Balkans and East Poland. If you, yeah, if you want to, you can take planes away from Finland and shift them to East Poland and Balkans. I already did. Uh, yeah. let me... Do more. Huh. 
Okay. No. Yep. Okay, yeah, my guys are coming in by train. They should be there in a matter of days. And I'm just gonna fucking... Uh, I'm just gonna micromanage sweep them through because they're about to encircle you. You. You might... If you can, you might want to just pull some guys out. I'm just do an offensive line push. Yeah. Actually, no, we could just... Uh, hold on. Just, just, just move what you can because they're, 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 there's a gap there. They're pushing through with everyone oh, they fucking have. Everyone they fucking have. No, wait, shit, fuck. Ah, oh, goddamn it. It's not what I wanted to do, but fine. You can, re you can. We're paused. You can undo it. Yeah. So I'll just do an offensive line through here. All right, yeah, sure. Fuck it, whatever. Okay. Yep, I'm just- I'm literally just moving my guys down right now as quickly as we can. Uh, mm -hmm. once they're down there, I'll form them into a line, but first I gotta, uh... I'm gonna help mop up there, because there's a multi-front line there, and I gotta... I yeah. gotta... Okay, unpause when you're ready. Alright, I'm ready. Okay. Yeah, hey. you know, there's not really much I can do with all these guys. I know, I'm coming down to help. Yeah, my guys are coming down by Twain. Uh, yeah, you have another um, army group here. Or army here. Uh, which which army group? Same. Or, well, army group four, the second one, and then you have a little bit of mustache. Okay. Thank you. I see Army Group 3 all the way at the end. Who does he have? That's the shit all the way in the east. Okay, never mind. Just making sure I know what shit is where. Oh, shit. Wait, nope. Fuck. Nope. Finland and the Soviet Union have signed a white peace. Oh, okay. Do we want to pause? Since we have exiled divisions, what does that mean? Oh, never mind. Okay. just stuck in Finland. Okay, it's fine. They're moving. Okay. I'm going to quickly do some reorganizing then. He's going south, I'm going to move a, uh... Okay, those guys are gonna... I'm gonna have those guys instead form a defensive line and start going after Norway. Uh, offensive line... I'm gonna start by capturing Narvik. No, not there. Jesus Christ. There we go. Hey. Why isn't that working? Come on, man. Oh, Cypher for Finland is fully decrypted now that I don't need it. <laughs> uh, what crypts do I have? I can crypt. I can decrypt. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I have no need to decrypt Finland now that it's finally done. Great. Anti-fascist policy is good. Next, seek a defensive pact with the Allies. Not enough manpower or equipment to fulfill our garrisons. We are missing 1,400 infantry equipment. Alright. So wants to make sure that's being dealt with. Uh, infantry equipment. Which infantry equipment do we need? Who's army, who's army group 4? Uh, I do. I'm moving them over here. Okay, because they're in a weird position. Okay, so we have so many armed army units, the army bar is getting annoying. Yep. I'm gonna... I'm gonna visually, for me, collapse some of them just so I'm not seeing as many. The ones I'm not managing, anyway. Um... What? Okay. That's not just you, because now I can't see any of my shit. Okay, well then we'll fix it. That, that's an easy fix. Why don't we do this? Yeah, maybe we should have uh, each a theater. Okay.
Okay, my guys are almost to the front there. Yep. We could try and enclose them over here. Yep. Maybe need to get some more tanks too. Okay. We're missing 11,000 guns. 11,000 or 1,100? 11,000. Almost 12,000. What happened? We fought. We, we, again, th this is what I've been saying. We, we've been on a, in a, de a deficit okay. of guns almost the entire time. Okay. And an average our, Russian moment. Yeah, our, the amount that we got was enough while not using them. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, we're building some more military factories, so we should be able to start well, here's the thing. more guns. I, I know. But then we have to go towards guns and the And that's mm. fine. But it's like, we just have to understand that we can't be like, oh, we're gonna, we gotta build planes now. I don't think we need to build planes. I think we're good on that for now. Because we've been doing nighttime raids, so that has been helping with the we, we uh, need plane situation. 1,800 fighters. Hmm. Okay. to a front line. Take the goddamn train. Thank you. Why was strategic deployment or you're off? It, again, it's always off. You need to, like, turn it. Whenever, a, whenever guys move, you have to click it so they go. Yeah, we're making slow prog uh, progress on the center front, that is to say the Polish front. Good, good. My guys are there now, so we'll start. I'm gonna start fucking sending... We're gonna just stop them here. Once the rest of my guys show up, I'm gonna put up an offensive line. Uh, I will probably... Yeah, uh, Yek, when I make my offensive line go, I may need you to push with some of your units just to stop the encirclement. Got it. Waiting for the rest of my guys to show up. Royce. Okay, and you've got guys that are coming in as well, that's good. Mm -hmm. Yep, okay, yeah, my guys are dispersing along the front lines, they're plugging the gaps. Not great. We got an encirclement. Where? Right. Oh, oh, you've got it. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. You know nice. what to do. Insert them there, okay, and... Yeah, so now that my guys... My guys are there, and the extra guys that you just whipped up are there. Uh... Lord knows we're trying. Okay. Pushing them back, but... Yep. It's whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Plug the gaps, push them back.
Okay, offensive line in action. My guys are pushing. I will need your support. Okay. Pushing into the salient currently. You're able to do another offensive line yourself and push into the salient. That will be good. Yep. Okay, switching my focus back to the north. What is that? A non-aggression pack of Ireland. We weren't even close to fighting you. What's the point, even? Cypher for Italy is fully decrypted. Great. Useless. Do you guys want me to show you what Italy's doing, or do we not need to bother? Fuck Italy. Don't worry about it. Okay. Uh, we have events. Oh, or, sorry, decisions. Do we want to add your prop? Uh, sure. Oh, hit. Decisions are being dealt with. That's good. Christ, stop. Fuck me. What is this? circle. What the fuck is going on over there? Expeditionary forces from Mongolia have been called back. That is fine. No idea what the fuck is going on over there. Got off. What the fuck? Smirna. Where are my guys? What the fuck is going oh, on? Oh my god. Так точно. guys doing? I have no idea. You have a national focus. I'm literally clicking on it. Ah, we're doing it wrong. Yeah, okay, so we're just pumping out military factories right now. That's good. Very good. Uh, 
под огнем. Plane six six, nice. What is six six? Is six six real? I don't know. Maybe, maybe we're as real as it gets. Right. Do you want us to unpause or we? I'm... Oh yeah, sure. Three military factories, good. So see no. Mean no template. Do you wish? Do we? Do you want to assign military factories to infantry equipment? Yes. City of Yekistan is uh, suffering a flood. Well, shit. Yekistan is suffering a flood. Come flood? A come flood, if you will. Yeah. Uh, they are fucking pouring guys into that gap. Yeah. So they're smarter than unfortunately. Yeah. The Mongolians are recalling their forces. Moshe Vale is on fire. Well, psh, fuck. Good news is they're on all adults serve. More like all Guess the... what, Grandpa? You're joining the army. More like all adult serve. Shut. This gap, like, actually, what the actual fuck is happening? Don't worry about it. They're pushing again hard. Yep, I see that. Are there? Do we have room with extra units being built? We could drop them in Kiev and add them to some of our forces. We don't have enough supply for them. Whatever. I was just asking. We're. we're... We are currently 23,000 and change in deficit. Germany has lost almost 5 million men. We have not even lost one. That is good at least. It's something. Canada, you gave us a lot, that's that's fine. 
Yeah, I'm gonna need help in closing this circle. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm already there. Unfortunate though, they they port this. It was in the front line that was there. There was one territory that no one had any armies on with the front line that they just poured through. in Nor- I need some guys up in Finland because the Norwegians are pushing through. Oh, Take the guys off the east. They're honestly not even doing anything. Uh, actually, no, never mind. I took them off the east. Yeah, they're, 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 there's guys up there that are taking that land. Can I spare at least a couple soldiers to go up there? I don't know if we have an, any to spare. I don't know. Yeah, the expeditionary forces that fucking Mongolia gives. Yeah, yeah. Going to front line. No, I want you to move off this line and move north. There's literally only seven of you. Jesus fucking Christ. Please, just move. Thank you. Moving north, that's good. How do you feel knowing is Moshville is on the western border of Ludwig II of Germany's border? Why is Ludwig II the ruler of Germany? Good question. In Civ VI, that makes no sense. It should be Bismarck or Wilhelm. Chismark? Yep, Chitzmark. Okay, there we go. Those guys are moving up, so I'll be able to fucking deal with fucking bullshit this is. Yep. Okay, they're taking their trains north. That's good.
Germans are over, starting to overextend themselves in the gap right now, so that hopefully bodes well for us. Yeah. I'm gonna wait a little bit before I launch my guys in again. Okay, let's see. Which, uh... No, I'm confused on which units I'm commanding. Yeah, I'm... Um... Yeah, I can't... I mean, I know which ones are mine. I don't know which ones are yours. I don't know which ones are mine. I, oh! You said I had Army 4, right? Yes. Well, great. Now they're stuck in the gap. That's... That's what we were trying to... That, that, yeah. that, that, that was the whole point! Okay, well, now what? Use them. Either pull them out of the gap, or... I, I either pull them out or have them attack something, otherwise they're going to be encircled. Yeah, pinch the gap. Pinching the gap. Yep. Guys. some micro pushes. Southernmost border ensure that border with Saudi Arabia. Hmm. Okay, we got a research slot open. Got it. About a month before our uh, yep. a month before our cryptology on the Germans is done. Okay, we'll, we'll try to make an offensive line over here, I guess. The British. Yeah want to buy convoys from us. Accept or decline? Sure. Accept it. Let him. Accept. You God, go to bed, Toad. Good night, Toadicus Rex. Thank you for hopping on. Thanks, uh, Toad. Oh, yes! We're pushing the Germans out in some area. Yes, one of my attacks is working. Good, 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 good. Yes, that is good, okay. Any any push we can make here is good. That is that is good. Small but good. The fuck, why are you moving all the way over there? I don't know. I have some guys that are, like, down there that are now being reassigned to the very top of the front line all the way in fucking Kaliningrad. Why? I'm, try I'm trying to uh, encircle this, but it won't let me. Yeah, one of the guys in... Why is one of the guys in my army group being reassigned? What are you doing? I don't know. You have no reason to go up. Okay, this is why my guys are struggling. Some of them have been deployed not on my front line, but all the way to the top. Why? Go to the fucking front line, please. God, that explains so much. Please 
did somebody move my guys into the defensive line of Army Group 4? I was just clicking on Army Group 4, but it might have. I did not touch you guys. Yeah, because some of my guys are now going all the way up the front line to somewhere that they're not assigned. Yeah, I have no idea. This is an absolute fuster cluck. Yeah, this is... What's going on up in the north? Nice. Next to Finland. What's going on up in the north is that someone or something moved my guys down that were defending up there. Ah, shit. And so then I, yeah, I didn't touch them. But somehow my guys moved down, even though they weren't assigned there. And now uh, the Norwegians and the Germans are sweeping. Okay, well, shit. Shit indeed. Hmm. Got a decision to make and a national focus. I'm going to switch over to a military thing. Uh, da da da. App. Terry reorganization. Go. Yeah, this is gonna... why, like, half my army that's supposed to be right there is not right there. What the shit? I don't know how to redo this without... without accidentally clicking them off. Um... Get off. Be an army group 10. I'm just gonna move these guys over here. Uh. Now I share a border with Persia. Yippee. Yippee. No, stop that. Stop moving there. You are not supposed to be there. I wish there was an easier way to tell what the specific orders for just one army are, so I can stop what the fuck they're doing. Yeah. Because right now, if I click off orders, I risk clicking off someone else's orders by accident, and I can't tell. I just have to guess. This army 4... Army 4 is, has a front... Army 4's front line is the whole front. I. Yek, you're Army 4, right? Yes. Army 4 is the whole. Army Group 4 is the whole front line. Okay, well, I just made. I think I just made a new one. Well, I see it. Hard to tell. I see it stretching across. Army, Army Group 4 stretches across the whole fucking front line. From the Black Sea to the North Sea. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. Yeah, that's the thing. I think your guys might be a little bit, might be overstretched. That's part of why they're not doing so well, because you have guys all the way up in uh, Meatballs. Yeah, I area. know. I'm trying to fucking fix that. Hold on. Okay. Give me a sec. I'm just trying to get it across this bulge here, but it won't fucking let me. Okay, there we go. Let's try that. Got up! No divisions. What the fuck is going on? Yeah, it's oh my god. Yeah, no, this is just They're going back? Why? Okay, I'm just gonna switch with all these fuckos. Figure out what the fuck's going on. Yep. 
Yes, there we go. Fucking moo. Ah, uh, there's so many... There's so many, uh, battle lines and I can't tell which one is which. They're just all overlaid on top of each yep. other. Um, if you mouse over it, it can tell you. I saw that you deleted, uh, four, which is fine. Uh, I... Yeah. Okay, there we go. Yeah. God, this is so fucking stupid. Uh... uh... Na, 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 na. Okay, in about eight minutes, I'm gonna have to haul, call it hard quits. Also, yep. a bunch of our guys are potentially about to be, like, totally oh, encircled stop. slash cut off. I'll go over there. Okay, there we go. There! Fuck me! God damn it. Good? I don't fucking time. Yep, you guys fucking take the goddamn train, get there faster. Okay, we back up Wait. to the north. Okay, yeah, my guys are forcing through, um, my guys are attempting, that's good. Oh, thank god. Activate that, activate that. Activate the... There we go. Okay. Intel is revealed. We know what the... Ger I, I can't read it like you can. You tell us what the Germans are doing. What are they doing? They're going back. Why are they going back into the fucking? Oh my god! Um. Okay, you know what? Whatever. Oh, they'll serve for economy. Um, they have 263 divisions in general total right now. Okay. They don't have that many tanks at all. Oh, yep, I'm pushing him. Yeah, I'm go. pushing it back. I'm pushing him back. Okay, yes. Okay, I'm I I, well. I had a similar issue going on. One of my guys, for some reason, was up, up against the whole fucking front line, and now I'm pushing them back. Now, because now I, this is what I meant to do like a while ago, but I fucking right. the front line tool is. I guess fucked, or someone may have accidentally done it. I don't know. Whatever, it doesn't fucking matter. Here we go. Just bit by bit. Fucking pushing. Oh, Jesus Christ. A lot of technology dealt with. One problem is that it's just a bunch of squiggles on top of another bunch of fucking squiggles. Yeah, if you hide, if you hold your mouse over it, it'll tell you which squiggle is which, though. Yeah, but they're all on top of each other. Yep. I'm taking some flash what? command here. Nope. So we can do some pushes. God, I've lost a lot of troops. Dealing with this fuck ass salient. Yeah, we, our, our casualties are going up pretty dramatically. Well, luckily we have the manpower. Yeah, we yeah, yeah we just we, we were doing so well before, but this is um uh. Yeah, this the, the this dumbass salient just 
kind of fucked us. Okay, so yeah, we, we need to start making united pushes on specific points. I'm going to start that. Making concentrated pushes. In select areas. Yeah, con heavy concentrated pushes in single areas. That's what allowed me to take that last thing. Yeah. Jesus Christ, Army 4, where the fuck are you guys going? Oh my god. Stop. Jesus Christ. Okay, I see a uh, 12 Division Army 4 thing against a weird part of the salient. Uh, I don't know if you want the guys there. Is it? Are you sending them against that? Are you sending that them to that area just north of the bulge? Uh, trying to. Okay, good. Okay. I click on the thing and it ju it just doesn't. They just don't want to. Okay. I was saying, if you're willing to, if we send all our guys right now, if we command all, you see that little bump in the bulge there with the German in the white uniform? If we send yeah. all our fucking guys there at him right now, we should be able to just knock that out. Okay. Fuck it, we fall. Ready? Yep. Three, two. Fucking send it in. There we go. Send them over on the on the small bulge up on the north. What do you mean small bulge in the north? Oh, okay, no. There you go. Yeah. Oh, they're pushing fucking elsewhere. Yep. <laughs> Nazis gonna do what Nazis gonna do best. Yes, they are. Okay, yeah, we've got a good win there. We just gotta keep chipping away at them. Yep! There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Do not fucking stop. Just keep pushing them. Do not in. charge. Keep pushing them in. Yeah, I, I'm, I, 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 I'm literally just I'm literally just highlighting all the guys there. Fuck it, they're all going in. That's what we just needed to do. We just needed to Ura charge. Oh. It's not really a new raw charge when they're, uh, you know. The British are giving us Hawker Furies again, that's good. Good. Okay. I was gonna say it is now 2 a.m. May I request that we pause and call it here? Sure. Sure. Alrighty, gentlemen. Is there anything you want to take care of before we go? Uh, no. Okay. I just gotta relearn how to fucking command troops again. You know, something up. Something, some, something was fucky with the front lines because it dragged my guys away from the north and then spread them out all along the front line, which meant that we couldn't properly deal with that fucking gap. 
now we got this shit. But it's fine. Finland's Finland's basically been dealt with. I just gotta have my guys defend against their pushes there, which they should be able to do. Yeah. Got off. Now they're running low on manpower. They have only five guys up there. Then you can just encircle the rest of them, yeah. I think I might have been... Uh, I would try and control army corps, but I might have accidentally... Been. Yeah, that might have been it. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, so... Again, I have... <laughs> I'm really bad at this game. Uh, I'm just trying to think. What do I have up here? Okay. Okay! I have... Yeah, because down here... Down here is just a complete... Yeah, down here is a shit show, but we're fucking, um... We... There's a couple areas we've managed to push in. So, that bulge, while annoying, will be dealt with. We just have to keep, again, like, united... United pushes on specific spots, and we're... They're running out of guys there. Yeah. They're running out of guys there. The, we can't hit the pinch right now because the pinch is where like most of their fucking guys are. So we just gotta whittle away the edges. All right. We could throw guys at the pinch just to distract them so they can't move. That might be good, but you know. Okay. Uh. And the north. Well, we have a more unified push against Polska. That is good. Or in, in the Polish area. Okay. I'm not pushing because we have we're missing fifty thousand guns. I understand that, but um, good, but good progress was made there. The line is better than it was when this started. So I'm not concerned about the line. I'm concerned about their manpower and their other units that they have. We can slice them off bit by bit and get rid of their divisions and include the manpower in those divisions. Uh huh. That's more important than the land itself. Mm -hmm. You can always get the land back. Yeah. They can't get those men back. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, which case, if we are all good here, gentlemen? Let's just take a quick look around the map and see uh, what are the goodies we have. South America's chill. Uh, For the most part, yeah. Italy is almost entirely chased out of Africa. They have a small holding in part of what is today Somalia, but they're losing that. Greece is still independent, which is hilarious. That is hilarious. They were they have so far been unable to conquer Greece. That is hmm. great. Um, let's see here. Uh, okay, Finland is annoying right now, but being dealt with. Um, Japan has been kind of stuck where they're at with China. It hasn't been able to do much more. I think they may have actually called a peace treaty there. That's good. Yes, that is good. Uh, also, it looks like uh, the Philippines are reconquering their territory in Japan, so America must have landed there. That's good. It's going to quickly check here. Yes, I can do that. Then we're going to what do, I do here. Improving that will be good. And national specialists go down there. That's good. Organization. Plan. Yep, okay, I'll start going for the economic stuff next again. Okay! Save. Alright. Well. Okay. 
That was something. That was something. We went through a lot of the game so far. And I was saying, based on that intel, what do we know about the out? What, what do we know about the Axis manpower? Like, are they indeed... Like, how... how nut? Yeah, how bad is it for them? They are on scraping the barrel. That is the highest point they can get to. Yeah, that is, that is good. So here's the thing. They are still... They still have enough manpower right now. But once that runs out, they have nothing. Yes. They should just completely collapse. Yep. Now, that's to say about Germany, uh, Romania is on extensive conscription, which is not good. Yeah. But the thing is, once Germany falls, a lot of the equipment that they will probably supply in Romania will go. Yep. Which means that, at the very least, they should be easier to deal with, thus cause more casualties, and they should be able to fall more easily as well. Yep. And Willem, uh, I will at least, yeah, once, once Germany falls and stuff, we can start there. Okay, uh, overall good. Now that we've got ourselves organized there, looking at the push, the push around the bulge is mostly looking green around the board, and we've got a better handle on our troops, and we've already been chipping away at them. So that is good. Right. It's going to be a hard fight. That salient is going to be the bloodiest part of this. Uh, folks, that has been. I'm hopping out. That has been the Soviet stream episode two, Hoi Four, part one. Yep. We, uh. <sighs> this has been kind of. This is fucking crazy. Uh,. Definitely glad that this is being co-opted, because playing the Soviet Union is intense. What about playing the Soviet Union with an idiot? Uh, that's fine, you're fine. Okay, okay. so. I want to briefly do some thanks. Uh, thank you Meatball Man and Yektan for playing with. I need to thank... No, thank no, you, no Moshe Moshe. There. You are very welcome. Uh, uh, remember, if you like the stream, to follow all three of us: Meatball Man, Meatball Double Underscore Man, Moshe Dale, M O S H E D A Y L, and Yektan, Y E C K T A N. Follow us all on Twitch. I think our next stream of this is probably going to be not this Monday, but next Monday, or sometime in like a little over a week from now probably close to like a week a week to a week and a half from now so we'll have time to breathe from this my next stream is going to be on tuesday i'll be thief of thiefing with yek uh yek what's your next stream uh i'm probably gonna take monday off to work on some DD stuff but uh i'll be doing sea of thieves on tuesday uh i might be streaming stellaris on wednesday and then uh probably going into near nice nice right uh thursday yes. i'll be thursday i'll be probably doing a little broken up art stream i'll see i may be going out with friends for thursday night so i may do a mini art stream that day but uh the next big stream will be sea of thieves on tuesday uh meatball All right. when is when is your next stream I might be doing one tomorrow for Valheim. Alrighty. Um, okay. Also, okay, I, uh, I, I, I might be able to play with you then. On Tuesday. Yep. Yeah, I was saying, depending on how it is, um, on on Monday, I I, I can't stream Monday because I have a night shift, but if you're still on, I'll join you for your stream in Valheim, depending on how late you're up. Alright, okay. I might be able to join you. Depends on uh, when you're starting. Um, probably rel it'll probably be relatively long because I don't. I'm gonna do be doing some stuff in the morning, um, mm -hmm. some errands I have to run. Um, but after that, because I'm off the whole day, right? Okay. Do some stuff around the house, and then once that's done, I should be fine. Yep. 
Awesome. Well, it's Martin Luther King Jr. Day for me, so I have that off. Nice. Remember, kids, do as Dr. King would have wanted. Kill Whitey. Actually, just kill cops. Just, yeah, just kill Whitey. And GTA. Kill Whitey. And GTA. Just, to, just kill Yetkan and GTA. Kill Yetkan yes. and GTA. Actually, uh, I'm for that. Do it. That's fair. Okay, uh... I am going to be signing off my stream in just a second. Again, thanks to everyone for coming by. Uh, I will see people on my channel on Tuesday for Sea of Thieves and maybe tomorrow? Monday, or I guess today, technically. Monday? Uh, uh, you might see me for some Valheim over on Meatball's channel. I won't be streaming that. It'll just be on Meatball's. So this is Moshe signing off.